Hello, we're live and you can hear us now, I'm pretty sure. Um, so great to be with everybody. We have some new friends, different friends than last week to play a game together with. Uh, and this week, the game that we're gonna be playing, the designers aren't with us right now because they live in the UK and it's the middle of the night, they're asleep. So I played with them earlier this week and I'll just be the one teaching for this Thursday night. But you can always go back and watch the replay on our YouTube with uh, Descent Games uh, playing Library Labyrinth tonight. Uh, before we get started playing, I wanna introduce our friends here. And also we are celebrating the fact that we're almost definitely gonna be Twitch affiliate in the morning after this stream gets recorded and this, we get the stats. So we're gonna be giving away two prizes tonight. Surprise, we didn't even tell you about it, but we're gonna give away the same prize our attendees that won shout out a palooza the team game shout out a palooza at january 22 we're going to give away the secret snail mail prize you can't quite see what it is and uh, but it's something like this small envelope sized and a t-shirt which i'm not wearing one today but there's a couple examples right back there so uh we let's see we have Maybe we should wait um, until the middle of the stream so that we have enough people to play, right? Because yeah. people kind of need a minute to filter in. So, um, hmm, hmm. You gotta dangle that carrot throughout the stream. Let people know. <laughs> right, right. Maybe do it at the end. And then, do you want to talk about your games at the end instead of the beginning? And maybe we can just get right into the teach. Does that seem good? Yeah, that sounds good to okay. me. All right, well, I'll just explain in general who's with us and um, go into the teach, and then we'll come back and kind of talk about their products as, or projects is maybe a better word to say right now. <laughs> um, it's not a product yet. <laughs> almost. It's kind of. It's like it's on its way for I'm sure. Um, but uh, talk about your projects at the end of the game after we're, we find out whether or not we won or lost at Library Labyrinth. So I'll uh, turn on screen top GG here. I've got my screen ready. And I'm going to go ahead and let everybody see how you set up a game in screen top GG from the very beginning, because I know that that's something that feels a little intimidating to people, all the different ways you can set up games um, online to play. So we're just on the homepage of screen top GG. This is pretty exciting, Library Labyrinth. Labyrinth is on that homepage right here. Okay, so. And also speaking of uh, how Library Labyrinth is doing, they're on Kickstarter and they have exceeded their goal. Nice. Uh, they're killing it. Ago, and they have four stretch goals total. Let's see. And you can see that they're three out of four. If I can find it. Where is it? the usual Kickstarter page that goes on forever and ever. There it is. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. So we've got three of the four. The only thing remaining is the cloth bags. And actually, wait, how close are they? Oh, they, actually they hit got it. it. They got it. It just nice. doesn't say so yeah. yet. Haven't so updated the JPEG, four. but. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All four of their stretch goals. So big congrats to them. So we're just going to hit play. And what this is going to do is create a unique room code, kind of like if you've ever played Jackbox or anything like that. I'm sharing this with my friends here in the private chat. Oh, and I forgot to say out loud who we have with us. So um, let me turn this off for a second so you can see everybody a little bit larger. So we've got Amanda is one of our like OG moderators. She's a local friend of mine here in Colorado. She's been a LFG primarily looking for a game moderator at Protospiel Online since 2020. She's all in for welcoming friends. She's not a designer. She just loves to play games and encourage people. She does a great job of making everybody feel welcome. And hey. we're super, super lucky to have her. And then her new coworker, a uh, brand new moderator for April 2022 is Michael. Uh, he's been an attendee since, uh, did you come in 20, late 2020 for the first um, time? Yeah, 2020, sometime in 2020. And has been coming pretty regularly. 
Anne has now uh, applied to be a moderator and we've accepted him. Hooray. So we have a new Ooh. friend on our team. And uh, and then Tim Lampinosa, am I saying it right? Lampasona. Yeah, it's, La it's Lampas close enough. Lampasona. It's a tough one. Yes, it is. <laughs> Hello, this is this is Chartreuse hair. That's James. Chartreuse hair. Do, I love it. Hey, James. I don't think I know who you are, other than that you're Char Chartreuse hair. But thank you for joining us. <laughs> James is um uh she's she's a uh, co-designer of Mononoke oh. and co-op member at Cardboard that Revolution. Chartreuse hair is James. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Hello. Good to have you joining us. Um, and that's exactly. What there is to say about Tim, um, what is it? Cardboard Revolution, right? Is yeah. the name of your studio that you're Yeah, we're a worker-owned cooperative design studio and uh, working on a whole bunch of stuff. And our most clo close to finished one is um, Mononoke. Yeah. Cool. And, and that's the I've one been... that you've been teaching the most at ProShville Online. And I think you also came in 2020. Um, yeah, I've been coming since, since they started the online ones. I've been, I've, I haven't missed one, actually, I don't think. It's been so it's like been the highlight of my every three months oh, well, that's <laughs> since great. it started Perfect. and then we have merlin i don't do you, does anybody who's sitting here with me know who merlin is there's merlin new person for me chat. nice to meet you <laughs> hi <laughs> awesome thanks for joining us uh, okay so now i can turn this back on now that I... it's max oh it's max hey max oh max like on your design team max yes okay <laughs> Sweet. Another uh, another <laughs> pro spiel uh, creature as well. Um, Max has been uh, bring, brings his uh, educational games or proto spiel uh, frequently, um, and they are all awesome. And you can play them all right now online. But we're here to talk about Library Labyrinth today. <laughs> yes, and um, maybe I'll just kind of wait. I, what we're gonna do the drawing at the end, and just keep mentioning as we get more people. You should stay at the end so you can play eBay price is right with us and win either a t-shirt or a shout out to Palooza snail mail prize. Yeah, you might actually get something by watching us hang out. Like that's that's a deal. Right, right. Okay, so um, I do have this. I'm gonna, I have another tab open with Library Labyrinth twice and just like another browser, but there's this really nice setup feature where if you hit the question mark, we can see the rules and the setup. Um, I have that open in another tab so I can look at it without blocking everybody's view of the table. Um, and I I sent you the room code, everybody, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm in there. I did. Okay. So, so on our end, for people that haven't used it, all you have to do is click on the link and it's going to open a browser tab and you're in the game. There's a join button in the top left that we've all clicked. We've entered a name like Heather is doing right now. And mm -hmm. you are playing a game in screen top. As easy as that. It's yeah, shockingly it's easy. You need to hit the um, join seat button. And let me just make sure that we join smart seats. Uh, it's not a big deal, but like, I think we're, it would be better, it would be better if I join green. Let me change that. So that we're all close together and we can see our hands all in the screen first. That makes sense. Like that. And you can see our, um, well, I can see my co-players, they're labeled, their hands are labeled with the names they set for themselves. And I think Cardboard Revolution must have logged in, actually logged in to ScreenTop GG. And that, and it just kind of auto-populated. Is that how it worked for you? Because you actually have an avatar and everything. Yeah, right? I think it's because I was editing our own stuff on there this morning. So I probably was still logged on from that. Cool. Yeah. But you don't have to have an account at all. Nope. Me and Michael and Amanda are not logged in. We just popped onto the homepage and press go. Super so, easy. <laughs> um, the it, the kind of overall point of what's happening in this game is it's like uh, Tim's main game that they're almost ready to bring to Kickstarter sometime this year. It's also a co-op. Oh, act, well, yours is semi-co-op. This one is much more absolutely friendly. We're only helping each other in this <laughs> game. And we are all, well, I don't think we're really so much embodying the women. <laughs> like we're just kind of corralling all these fictional and uh, historical women from the library that are working to get the terrors that have come out of the books back into their books. So we're mm -hmm. gonna have a, a, 
a set of face down tiles that we're going to explore out from the middle. And we're going to take, um, I can take a couple cards and just kind of show us what they look like before I put them back in shuffle. So I'm pushing space bar to make this large, but we'll have like different um, abilities kind of to put towards getting the terrors back in the books. We'll play card sets to do that. And um, yeah, it's really beautiful set of art on the books. We have different, and the, the characters are all in these thematic decks, children's fiction, classic fiction, legends, science, historical leaders, amazing lives, and that's it. So I think these would probably be like more like the biography type people. Mm -hmm. But uh, uh, over here on the, I've got this, this thing open on another screen. I'm looking at the setup. And we need to, we have a couple of things here already. These are for uh, changing the difficulty of the game, the like extra pieces. Mm -hmm. But what we have started here is the base, the medium level difficulty, basically pieces. And from these, we're going to take the right amount of cards for the amount of players. So it's 24 cards for four players. Oh, okay. We already have 24, so we don't need to do anything like that. So these are these these cards are going to show us what the curse does. Um, after each of our turns, the curse is going to move. The, this thing is the curse. It's going to move clock, clockwise in, in these spaces and affect the spaces next to it. So like right now, this space is the one that would be affected by this card. And there are four different ways, uh, like states that that tile could be in. And what we do with the tile is defined on the side based on whether it's got some, it's filled, it's an empty terror tile, it's an empty not terror tile, or it's flipped over or face down. So we're gonna take, I'm double clicking this to select the whole pile and I'm shuffling it with Z. Now I'm gonna take one at a time and you all can help me if you want. It doesn't matter. We just need to randomize these. Just this try is, not to fight over it and fill out the playing this field. This is the true co-op teamwork test. Yeah. <laughs> can we it avoid now? stealing each other's pieces? Yeah, wait in line. <laughs> wait your turn. Ah, I, I broke the line. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, no, this co-op game is gonna go so well. It's gonna be great. <laughs> I believe in us. I think it's gonna be I think we're Already gonna be okay. The best you know, it's it's None fine. We're gonna line up in a circle. No. <laughs> this That's is the only semi related. How nice is the contact point system in screen top? You just drag it anywhere nearby and it finds a space. It's beautiful. Exactly. Yes. Yeah. And yeah, you can very you can be very definitive about what things are supposed to be able to snap mm -hmm. to what things too. Yes, that's amazing. That that's a very nice feature. So these things here are the sh the empty shelves or the shelves to replace um, the terrors onto, or sort of like the book waiting for the terror to uh, come back into it. And I'm going to also shuffle them. So there's one of each of these colors in it, and I'm going to shuffle the terrors. They're going to come out when we flip a tile over and it has a terror on it. So we'll just um, do that as it comes. And especially, be, you know, the nice thing about a co-op game really is that I can just teach as we play because it's not like when the rule comes up, we'll all talk about it together, you know. <laughs> um, yeah, but these, these spaces are for... The goal of the game is to fill out these six spaces before one of the losing conditions happens, which I probably should uh, check my player aid for, but I know having five terrors out on the board um, causes you to lose. And there must be another one. That was the one I was the most afraid of when I was playing it um, before. So I'll, I'll refer six to that. Or more, six or more terrors are loose, you lose. Okay, uh, and if there are no no more disturbance cards to draw, you lose. These things, okay. If you run so out of these cards, you lose. 24 cards, okay. Yep. Perfect. Those are the only two ways. And the way we win is to fill all these spots. So we'll put the terror that goes with the condition here and the, con and the condition here. These two tiles kind of will end up over here. OK. And we put our meeples here in the center. 
And oh, you'll also notice, oops, 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 I'm using the wrong control. I didn't use the plus here. Um, there's a compass rose on this center right tile that we start on. And there's also a compass rose on these cards. So that's what determines the orientation. Like if we weren't playing it in this fixed view, okay. um, we were sitting around the table, that's how you would tell which tile it's talking about, even if you move the cards around the table. Oh, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where is the where is the uh, player aid you guys are referencing? Is that in Top real right. life or another tab? If Top you right corner, hit the open question the mark. question mark like this. Oh, and then the I've not mark. used that feature before. So you can yeah. create your own player aid inside of ScreenTop that people can reference like a rule book. Look at this. Nice. Mm -hmm. And cool. then, uh, well, we need to know our our, our moves, our, the things that we're allowed to choose to do. And okay, yeah, right. You get these when you land on a tile that has them. Okay. So, and we need to choose who goes first too. Michael, do you want to see what happens if we try to do Jonathan's like crazy math? Yeah, thing? yeah, let's do it for sure. But we, we have to, you ha we have to have a an order. Like okay, right, right. So we'll, so just we'll use look the... at this table as if it's the order, right? We've got. All right, we can do us. that. We're we're sitting at this table. This is clockwise, right? And we'll start with. We'll say I'm the owner of the game since I'm the host, right? So what we're gonna do is kind of like rock, paper, scissors, but instead of throwing, you know, rock, paper, or scissors, we'll throw a number, I think just on one hand, right? So a number between one and five or zero, I think you could just do a fist for zero, right? And we're gonna add them together. And that's gonna be the number that we count around starting with me. Like an eeny, meeny, miny, mo, and the person it stops on is the person that goes first. Oh, hey, David. But the amount of meeny, minies, and moes is the sum of the total fingers. Right. Okay. So, but Sounds all you need good. to know right now, like, I'll take care of it. All you need to know right now is we're going one, two, three, and pick amount amount of numbers to throw on your on one hand and show me what, what it is. Okay? Ready. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> okay. So, we said three, so that's six, eight, twelve. So I'm going to go one, and then um, we're going clockwise. So blue is next. Who's blue? That's me. Where's, OK, so you're two. OK. Red. Who's red? I am. OK, so Michael you're three. Fred. So say four. now four, five, Tim, count six. <laughs> Wait, I'm so confused. Me. I lost it. You lost counting, me. I'm sorry. counting in order. Uh, going we're around counting the to table. 12, one okay, at a time. I'm six then. <laughs> one. Okay, we're good. So I'll go one, Tim. Two. I'm passing it to three, you. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Oh, no. <laughs> you go first. <laughs> You're like, I, I refuse to say it. I, I didn't hate understand. I first in new games. I'm sorry. It's gonna be okay. I I, I, I couldn't I couldn't even figure out how to play the mini game to figure out who to goes first. You don't want to go first. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be a disaster. I, was, I, was, right. <laughs> okay. I, think it's I appreciate so much... counting it out. <laughs> I think it'd be so much easier if we were sitting at a table, right? Maybe it's you're right. Yeah. And we've got like two layers of things to untangle, but mm -hmm. I think it worked. It it was. It amused me anyway. And uh, someone in the chat that. is like, don't they know that 12 is divisible by four? Why are they counting this one at a time? <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're probably. Also yep, that. yep, that's true. <laughs> we know. We're sorry. Let us yeah. have our fun. Actually, I math after dark. Thank you very much. <laughs> yes. Going first isn't so bad in this one, Amanda, because your choices are more obvious if you go first. Okay, cool. Um, so the things that you can do are move. And you can either basically move and do thing, move and do thing is kind of how move works. It depends on what you're landing on, what, how, like how the move is going to completely work. So if you're landing on a terror that you, you have the materials to put back on the shelf or to capture, actually, uh, the materials to capture, you move and capture it. And if you have a terror that you have captured, uh, you can move and shelve it. Uh, but you can't move through a terror if you can't defeat it. And um, you can move as far as you can go before you're obstructed. So we just have to, um, I was, I, I had the designers with me and they were much better at seeing, oh, that's, 
that's blocked. <laughs> you can't go that way. So we got to look carefully and make sure um, there's not a shelf in our way. Like once we flip one of these over, it'll make more sense kind of what the maze starts to look like. But um, or so moving, we can't really move yet because every, we, everything's dark. Flipping means anything adjacent to you. Um, I'm going to say that's orthogonally adjacent to you. Like you right. can't do this one, but you could do any of these four. That's basically, that's got to be your first move, picking one yeah. of those four to flip. Right. Um, you can also rotate tiles 90 degrees in either direction. Although sometimes the curse card causes them to rotate a specific direction. Um, but when you're choosing to rotate, you can choose one or the other direction. I think it's always clockwise with the curse. And um, you can take a, any book card from the cat, the book piles, or you can help a friend if they're with you. So donate, receive, swap, like exchange a single card or multiple cards, one with one other player, and um, you can give a take a card. Uh, both players must be standing on the same floor tile unless you have a special ability. Oh, and you know what else? I think we're supposed to have. Um, we need to draft our hands, and we're supposed oh. to have a goodie also. Yes, please. I'm ready. Sure. So and one, these are these are reward cards. Mostly we get these when we land on treasure chests in the maze, but we get just take one. We just get one to start. Ooh. And then it doesn't really matter turn order. We want to take a variety of these books and kind of just pick what we want to take three of them and flip them face up so everybody can see them. The main thing to know about them is that they're all if it's red, it's going to have at least one heart icon on it, but then it'll have a variety of some other things and this, et cetera. It goes down the line like that. Okay, cool. So and we just pick you, five of any of them, or is it? No, no, three of any of them. Three, three. Yes. Okay. But you, but it's, it's kind of good, right? Kind of just take a variety. So like each of us, and we we should take them and flip them over, like put them face down so we can see whether we've got variety, and then we'll all flip them over at the same time. If that makes sense. Oh, okay, that's cool. Um, and you'll notice, yeah, some of them are more rare than others. That might not be the way it is when this game is completely finished. Because um, they're thinking about more women to add that fit. They were very insistent on making them uh, thematic. Like the, it's a real woman that's in the public domain. <laughs> uh, I appreciate that. that. that uh, just, uh, just three, Michael. Just three. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I said five and I screwed up the whole Cheating thing. Cheating <laughs> already. I shame. listened to the wrong person. And, and as the yes. space implies, we have uh, just six, uh, six card hand limit. Oh, we've got. I like how the design of the tile suggests what the game means by adjacent. Yeah, yeah. And we're saying hello to you, David. Okay. Um, sorry, forgot that step. Now we can flip these all over. Who do I got? And then I can show you. It's a little bit larger. I'm really, really heavy and flush and purple and blue. And then my special reward is a um, just a lot of purple. But there's some of these that are special actions, like you can do one or the other of these when there's two of them on it. When So for uh, this is Michael's hand, this is ability he has. When using the take a book action, you may take one additional book from any category. So you could take two of the same or two different. And then when using the move and capture action, you may mimic a book character in your own hand in order to double their skills. That's so cool. So maybe with just one card, you might be able to get a terror. Um, and then some more actions here. When using the flip action, you may flip a tile to its left side from anywhere. You do not need to be adjacent to the tile. Interesting, the flip action from its left it's, side. This is new to it's me. Lit, it's lit side, yeah. so you can- Lit side, oh, lift, lit side. So, that makes so much more sense. <laughs> I was like, left. Any, I'm guessing you could take any dark tile anywhere and flip it, that's pretty powerful. Okay, cool. And yeah, that's right. using any move action, you may sneak past one act of terror. So I said, usually you have to be able to capture it, like have the materials to capture it. 
but um, you can sneak past it if the route would otherwise be accessible. So as long and as these the walls are, are separate in the way. These are all one-time use. These right, yeah, you'll treasures. play them to the discard down here. Got it. I have uh, Mulan. And I, this I am going to learn a lot of famous women today. <laughs> yes, you are. I, I have never, I cannot even pronounce uh, this character from Les Miserables because Eponine? I probably can't. Eponine Thenardier, one of the best Thank characters you. of the musical, anyway. I have not Excuse read the book. My Spoiler alert. Uncultured <laughs> self. <laughs> there are definitely no. some things in here very difficult to pronounce. I'm, I've heard Eponine said out loud. Like this one. Time. Yeah, that one. Sorry, I don't speak Mesopotamian. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody does, though, to be fair. It's okay. So not that means you get to decide. <laughs> It's like Latin. You can pronounce whatever you want. Nobody cares. Mm -hmm. Cool. Qua Mulan. Yay. Yes, this one. This one I was able to pronounce. Thank you, Disney. Yeah, that was cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> name. I could have sworn it's like they say it Fa Mulan. Maybe that's how it's pronounced, even though it starts with an H. I don't I know about that. I was wondering the same thing. I was like, surely Eddie yeah. Murphy said it right. But uh, <laughs> I couldn't base it on that. We can right. trust Eddie Murphy. Right. He's known for his correct, correct <laughs> phonetic pronunciation Absolutely, of Chinese yes. names. <laughs> this is really neat. Yeah, I'm mm -hmm. excited. Um, yeah, it's, and it's really fun to, you know, get to play something. Actually, the desi designer isn't even here. That's a proto spiel game. Um, Although I do also like having them with us because they get to, I think the sensation of getting to watch people play your game is kind of a special thing for designers. You know what I mean? Yeah. They like run it. Yeah. Like it, it can run without you. You just can observe it happen. They're going to have to watch it tomorrow. Helpless. Oh no. Sorry. <laughs> like bad choice, bad choice. We won on Monday and they said, you know, we played this so many times that we're probably the best two players in the world this game mm -hmm. and so we definitely won we'll see if we can make it this time james hexagons i agree are the best Hexa yep. mm -hmm. yeah hexagons are the best agons james <laughs> the best yes very bad <laughs> awesome okay um and we have more people joining us i'll just remind the new viewers that we're going to be giving away two prizes after we finish playing the game by playing the eBay game Price is Right style close without going over wins. So we'll talk about that a little bit later. Okay, so Amanda goes first. Now I uh -huh. think we're really fully, fully set up. First thing you gotta do is just flip. You gotta flip. pick something to flip that's adjacent to you. Flip, 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 Adelphia. Oh, that's and useless, then, uh... great. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, can't go in there. <laughs> Yeah, they are oh, octagons, actually. It. <laughs> <laughs> hexagons they're functionally hexagons, right? Oh, actually, no, they're not. They're functionally yeah. squares. It's even yeah. funnier. <laughs> I stand by it, though. The best agons are the hexagons. <laughs> well, it depends I already on told all the of you use. I don't do math after dark, so. <laughs> right? Depends that on the use. trigonometry. Uh -huh. This, I think for the, the way that the curse works. Yeah, it's awesome. It turns out being very elegant, but mm. uh, yeah. That it just slots in there is really cool. Yeah. Uh, a tessellation, right? Ooh. Yes. So this is one of those shelves. So it gets populated with one of these. We find out what heck we can put here. This means that uh, we'll see a terror soon, I'm sure. Uh, if a terror needed some blue, to be captured, then it qualifies to be put away here, if that makes sense. So you're trying to shove them back into their books, right? Yes. Um, okay, and they all have like a different kind of book they want to be back in. I got you. Right. There's a uh, first, I mean, terrors usually will have maybe three different colors, two or three different colors required mm. to kind of mash together to have the skill to get them back in. Cool. Or get them captured, like get them under control. And then you kind of need to carry them over and shove them back on the shelf, right? in the goosebumps um, five. Yeah. Good yeah, one. totally. <laughs> yeah. So this one is blocking us. So that's something you might choose to do is rotate it so it's possible for us to get to it. But we also just need to uncover some terrors. So you might want to flip it 
you you get three moves, so you can do two more things on your turn. Okay. Well, I mean, the first one was super great, so let's try that move again because I like it. Okay. Okay. There's a terror. Cool. Oh, good. good. Perfect. It's. I mean, it blocks our way, but we need to find them and capture them. So this one, Cerberus. Here's that example of. It needs two different colors, so it won't be able to be stuffed in this shelf. But uh, it's uh, relatively doable. We are kind of, we can kind of, we should be talking about, you know, who has what, who has some pink and, does any one person have enough pink and yellow? I have especially a star using and that's it. So, yeah, so can we talk for a second about the, the way that, um, I guess, caging or booking, shelving the terrors works? I, I see we have these characters and they all have, uh, attributes, those are spent or are required to shelf a terror? How does that work? Yeah, I'll just kind of skip ahead. Like, let's say, okay, these, uh, your, your card, these two cards together would uh, take care of Cerberus, right? So there's one pink on this one, on, on this one, mm -hmm. and two yellows and one pink on. Collectively, they have the four icons that Cerberus needs to go back right. to its book. So if you yes. get to Cerberus, you put these two cards together and you put Cerberus on top and they have to hang out in your hand, filling a spot okay. until you get to, until you can get to a shelf where you can put it away. Okay. So that fully spends those two characters and the terror holds them in a spot in my hand. And then I have to put them in a shelf that matches what? Either pink or yellow. Because and yellow, of yellow corresponds to orange legends like it this has a star on it and that's the same as this got it so it's gonna be a little, little bit before your turn but you are yeah. a pretty good person to get it yeah so. i got it leave the the trio of puppies to me y'all okay. um and is there any limit to how many characters you can use to take out a terror you can use any as many as you need as many as you need but you want to use as few as possible to sure to optimize your moves Cool. Um, yeah, and it's not blocked. Michael can get to it, so we could just leave that for his turn. Um, if you want to flip another mm -hmm. one, or if you want to give him something. Zoom or in on uh, that between the two, uh, left and our, our center place, and the right green here? library to the left. We can't. Oh, oh, we, oh we can. Can't we, wait. No, 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 no. no, no. Can't it, There's yeah, a problem. Right. Yeah, you can't okay. use space because it, it rotates it in your view, or you've got to be careful oh, using yeah. space. Okay, very good point. Oh, yeah, it does. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to move that. I'm just trying to move up here. But so yeah, right this now, one is okay. A, the only this way out is through Cerberus. Mm -hmm, unless you flip another tile. Or yeah. okay. you can do a, if, like, I think we're okay because Michael has everything needed for the Terra that we can see. I don't think you need to trade so, right now, but you can only oh. do it when you're together, so... I was born we are further. together right now, but it's not advantageous right now. Got it. Okay, so I have to flip another one. Got it. Yep. Or the last oh. thing you can do is, I don't think you want to hear, but you no. can also give an action to the next player if you oh, have yeah. a reason to not act. Oh, next that's time Cerberus's sure. new home right there. Yep. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Um, easy peasy. And then, and then what we'll, I mean, I can do it. If you want me to just always do it, or if you want to do it on your turn, the curse needs to take a turn now too. So this is a green, a good screen top feature. Request to retain orientation when magnified. Yeah. Yes. Maybe. Or like having, having a hot key for that. Like yeah. if I hold shift mm -hmm. space what or something. Because the reason it, uh, the reason that it it auto orients its orients itself is because oftentimes. Well, I mean, these cards are a good examples. Someone might be looking at this card upside down and you want to be able to read it by pressing space and having mm. orient to your field of view to read the content on the card. But being able to toggle that back and forth would be a really nice feature. Yeah, I cool. agree. That'd be cool. So <clears throat> do you, do you want to, on your turn, do you want to move the curse and look at the card or do you want me to just kind of run the curse for us? What feels better or more fun for you? Don't all speak up at once. Feels oh, better. I, thought I don't know. <laughs> I've never experienced a curse. Let's get weird. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you want to do it yourself, draw a card from the curses upon me. Flip it over oh. into the use section. Boop, boop, flip. And right. um, oh gosh, did we not shuffle these? 
it's where I'm no, no, we did shuffle it. I'm just trying to remember. And maybe somebody's looking at the rules in the right place. Whether I think you flip the card and you do what it says where the curse is now, and then you move the curse. Is that the that right order? Makes sense to me, but let's double check real quick. So I'm going through, is this the disturbance step in the rules? Yeah. No, okay, that disturbance comes before yes. curse. Yes. Yeah, that's what's okay. happening now. Yes. Draw a card so, from the disturbance deck. Um, these are the curse is come upon me. Mm -hmm. Makes me think all oh, your bases then, belong to yeah. us. Yeah. yeah. So what I, what I said <laughs> is right. The instructions on the card. It will highlight uh, one floor tile, which is identified in its position relative to the curse marker where it currently is. We're going to move it later. Right. What happens? But do to we the have floor? a curse marker right now? I'm confused. It's, it's right the here. orange marker oh, that Heather is is uh, by. Okay. What happens so, to the floor tile depends on the current status of the curse. So we look at the curse, and then it's going to be to the bottom right of it because of the red uh, tile indicated on Amanda's card. Is that yep, right? That's right. So this and like I said, that you see the that compass rose. It doesn't matter now, but if you we're were referring to the center right? tile. Yeah. If we were this one then, right? That's highlighted. I flip that because it's the mm -hmm. red one. And it says if the tile is dark, which it is, flip it over. Okay. Boom. And it's you reveal another... a tear. So you put a, a tear okay. on. <clears throat> and there's some other things. Um, we were talking about Agatha Christie when I was with the designers because we chose who went first based on who had read a book most recently. And my husband and I are reading Agatha Christie together. Hey. So um, we recently read one called The Mirror Cracked from Side... The Mirror Cracked or The Mirror Cracked from Side to Side. And I believe this quote comes up a ton in that book. The curse has come upon me from the Lady of Charlotte. Yes. Chat, chat has That's pointed that cool. out for us as well. Again, pointing <laughs> out how uncultured <laughs> and unlearned <laughs> I am. I'm aware that Lord Tennyson is a person, but mm, hey. beyond that, got a lot and of we, nothing. We, <laughs> we can go ahead and flip it over, too. Uh, anytime one comes out, we'll get okay. to see what it is. Ooh. Um, and then the curse moves one space clockwise, and now then your turn is all the way over. Or, cool. Yeah, that's great. Good news. <laughs> I don't like taking turns. Why am I playing this game? <laughs> I love taking turns. I'm really glad when mine is over when I'm first. <laughs> I'm like, am I done yet? Am I done yet? How about now? I needed to watch like three people play before me. <laughs> you did great. There'll be a lot okay. more to do next time it's your turn. Okay. More decisions to make. Uh, okay. I'm so, so good at those. <laughs> trying to get my head around this. So your color, are you yellow? Yes, I am. Oh, oh actually, Michael's next. Mm -hmm. That's great. Perfect. And you oh, got am? what you need for- Oh, I was looking at the order of the, the meeples. Oh, oh, good. I'm not ready. OK, so I get <laughs> actions. I get three actions. Those actions are to move, to capture, and to reshelve. Yeah, you'll be able to in two moves if you want to get Cerberus. Yeah, let's and put Cerberus that. here because you're totally unblocked. That would be two moves. I, it feels like this is what I was made for. Um, <laughs> so I'm gonna. Yeah. So I can move. I want to make sure I'm understanding the mechanics too as I go through it. So I can take a moving capture action, move it, but as far as I'm able to on unblocked lit tiles, and then end on the terror and capture it. And that's one move. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to move down to this Cerberus. Traveling uh, music. <laughs> I'm going to, yeah, this music is intense now. I'm going to, <laughs> the, do we know the names of these different resources? The the pink and the yellow? They're on um, your card, actually, right? Well, they're... Well, oh, yeah, it's not on like the card. Yellow is flexibility and pink is storytelling, right? Oh, but well, they're different it's also prediction one. and so that they have oh, different names. Oh, so it's like general oh, character traits. But yeah, we know that we know what they're based on though. Like green is science. Uh, that's blue what I'm looking is, for. Thank you. Oh, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. So there, there are sub. I mean, I guess they just really wanted a lot of traits that go with the woman, and so these are different kinds of 
legendary traits. I can yeah. see that. All right. Like Mulan has three. They're all in the legendary category, but they're all a little bit different thematically. That's neat. Yeah. All right. So I don't know. I'm going to spend my two yellow, my two pink. After all that, we're going to call them colors. And, <laughs> right. Uh, That's what we were doing when we played. I didn't and, even ask about that. <laughs> and grab Cerberus. And, uh, and so I've captured a... I have done it. I've done the thing. I've oh. captured a terror, right? I'm pretty sure when you capture a terror, you get a reward card if you have the uh, card. You only do this if you have the cards you're going to capture it. You must capture it. Okay, I've done so. Mm -hmm. uh, let me see if there's anything in the rules for that. Capturing. How to capture terrors? We've done it. Once it's captured, the player collects all the cards together, puts them in one slot, um, mm -hmm. and we're holding it, imagining the monstrous terror is trying to escape again. So they have to hang on to it and bind it until we get back. Um, it doesn't say anything here about a reward. Maybe the reward comes from reshelving it. Um, it says Maybe. here about the reward cards. As you that travel to the library, you may find a floor tile with a treasure chest. Those are rewards. You get those by moving on to the treasure chest tiles. Um, I, that's it, I think, actually. Okay. Oh, All you right. win a reward when you shelve it, so you're about to get one. That's oh, you do? Get, okay, yep. cool. So there's Place two ways the to get a reward. cards and finally win a reward when you shelve it. Okay, so let's do that. So for my second move, I'm going to move and place a terror, which is a thing you can do. Move and reshelve. Move it as far as I can to an appropriate place and reshelve. So I'm going to move down to here. I'm going to zoom in. And these look really cool when you zoom in. The 3D perspective really oh. pops when you get in close. Mm -hmm. Of the shelves? Yeah. Okay. yeah the shelves. So this is, we're going to call this a legendary uh, or a legends icon, a yellow star. And I get to reshelve the Cerberus, which means I place it in the legends book because that's where i yeah right shelving. so this thing is going to go here and cerberus, and cerberus here. goes to the right of it and then the right. cards that were involved with capturing cerberus go down to the discard okay got that and where does cerberus go he goes into this little, little eyeballs. creepy eyeball spot next to the okay the legends right. yep good stuff all right uh so that's and i get a reward which our hands are all public knowledge to each other. So I that's show right. you guys my reward. Yep. Sweet. Oh, oh man, that's awesome. Sweet. Spear of Minerva. Yes. Classic. Very good uh, turn. So that functions as just those two resources, I guess. That's right. Are they permanent resources since they were a treasure card or they're just extra just because? I spend they're, them they're with the character. Usable, okay. yeah. Gotcha. <clears throat> all right. And I get one more action. Lots of decisions. But I think it's I'm going like to keep a free card draw because otherwise you need to yep. take an action, use an action to draw a card. Right. Yeah. And it's like I can equip it to a character to give them those extra traits. Neat. Nice. All right. Uh, and then for my last action, I think I'm going to make one of these. I'm going to keep building out the library so we can keep finding terrors. So that is, I didn't even see where you got those from, Amanda. Hmm? Where are the where are the, the curse? Um, they're room. down at the bottom of the yes. screen. It says right. curses before, upon me. But before oh. that, I want to do. Oh, they're up here. No. Oh, I just what flip it. Think? I'm yeah. done. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just flip it. But you got to put one adjacent to it. Flip it and you flip it, and it's great. But it's got to be there. Go. All right. That one. So that's do my that third one. turn. I'm going to do, do that curses one. upon me. No, wait. What? You can't do that one. You're not next to it. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Well, like actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. Adjacent don't, to the wait, where you're at one. on the board? Let's just pretend this one, because you showed us what it was. Let's okay, sure. That's fair. Flip this one. Got it. Oh, no. Okay, so it makes happening? sense. I am peering into the next room, and it's a it's a four-way junction. Hey. Okay. Classic library. All right. Uh, curse is upon me. So... I have revealed that tile, uh, and and so we are going to, let's see, curse is here. So top left, cop tile is dark, so I'm going to activate it. Seems like, oh, oh hello. another baddie. Just take it from the spot? Mm-hmm. Yep. Hey, that's a reference I get. Yay. <laughs> Yay. 
does the that and the pendulum comes out all right and that is i well let me make sure i'm doing all the things i'm supposed to do on my turn so i i took my actions i did a disturbance and then the curse needs to move right move oh. one junction clockwise oh i've got the perfect card for the pit and the pendulum everybody nice right, nice same. curse I always moves around the outer ring and never comes into the center so i don't I'm having trouble interpreting that. Move one junction clockwise, just so here. It goes to here, yeah. yeah. I'm just gonna yeah. hop around the this outer yeah. grid. Okay. So far, it feels kind of like the curse isn't so bad. Like the curse is upon <laughs> me, it's helping us reveal tiles, which is something we're spending our turns doing anyway. But well, I feel like get it gets the tricky area. when it comes back because it's gonna start repopulating these terrors. Yeah, that's gonna be a little oh. bit more problematic, isn't it? Yeah. Good point. Yeah, so it's kind so of let's gentle. Try and keep dark spaces around the terror and do what you guys are already doing and open up stuff away from where the terror is. Good idea. I, okay. yeah, like uh, idea. Over to um, who's up next? Tim. That's me. Right? Thank you. Yes. Yeah, I believe so. Yeah. Um, all right. What have we got? Pit and a pendulum. Heather, you said you got that? Yeah, I've got mm -hmm. one card that matches it perfectly, so I should definitely use that. Okay. What cool. is the name of her that matches the pit and the pendulum perfectly? Uh, Wanthong. Yeah. I can Beautiful. take out yeah. Forest of Thorns, but I need to rotate this card twice to do it. Wanthong is the Thai epic poem about a woman caught in a love triangle between two men. Oh. I think um, I saw so okay, I could I could use the same action twice in a row, obviously, right? Seems yes. that way, yeah. Okay, so I think I'll rotate this twice. Okay. And then I'll do a move and capture on Forest of Thorns. Oh, oh, be, and you have the uh, stuff to yeah, get it. Yeah, I can, I can use. Uh, Actually, I have a couple ways to do it, um, but I'll use uh, Anne Shirley with uh, Tirgatau. I'll just put that there with him. To get the Forest of Thorns, okay? Because cool. I need just a, oh, yeah, I need just a blue and a red, and I have both those with them. Well, and a, there's a green there too. You've got a green as well. Uh, yes, right. Anne has that. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Cool. We're on a first name basis. <laughs> <laughs> and i think that's all three actually yep because you did this twice yeah yeah so i'm good and oh, that let's do the curse first turn and then my turn yeah uh okay so uh -oh. oh nice great we got a new terror yeah it's actually not <laughs> they do get scary after a while oh great the basilisk you love Ooh. to see it that he's so it's on over. Remind me again where we're headed with this. We win by heading, getting how many terrors back in the book for a four-player game? Well, making this perfect set. So oh, we need them all. Yeah. So part of this challenge is finding the shelves. Like we have to uncover six shelves. Yeah. We also can if we stuff this one full and uh, get it flipped over, and the curse flips it over, we'd know. For example, this one would get filled again from as long as there's some here to fill with. Okay. Um, but hopefully we'll just find them automatically. Oh, can can we do that? Can we flip it dark? Flip a dark tile to the light. No, we cannot. So we have to have the curse, How does the curse... make a light tile dark if we wanted to use it again to uh, well, get another we we might have power cards that let us slip it dark or something like that. Yeah. Um, okay, so gotcha. So we need to find, basically we're looking for lots of libraries with the right icons so we can send the things back to them. Yes. Right. And we want to be like careful about, you know, if we have something that, uh, for example, yeah, the Basilisk, mm -hmm. one of the things that can be put away on is already taken care of. Yeah, right. so that's not useful to us anymore. So and like, we have this one blue one, and both of these can go to it. We need to decide which one we want to put towards it. Maybe this one, because this one has more new, other options. Like, 
this one would yeah. have only one option left if we didn't put it here, for example. Makes sense. And we lose with how many terrors are active at once? Six. Six. Or when this deck runs out. Which is a turn counter. Mm -hmm. Okay, got it. Okay. And don't forget, I'm holding a, a terror as well. Um, that can also go to this blue space, but we I can okay. keep hanging on to it if needs be. But it it's actually our only green, so we might want to save it. For a green bookshelf to open up? Yeah, it's not a bad idea. Gotcha. So our goals are open books to get more um, to get more characters to to help us combat these terrors, and then try and find libraries to put them in. And do what Tim did, which is connect everything so walking around is much easier. Because this library is a mess, frankly. <laughs> Disaster. <laughs> We're gonna, yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, is this that setup random? Are the these? Yes, it is. We did that utterly chaotic co-op game. Where, yeah, insanity. Yeah, random. It's, it's as randomized. random as it could humanly be. It's like a meta <laughs> co-op game inside of the game. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It, okay, so you did everything on your turn that the curse needed to do. It's now my turn. Uh, yeah. yes, we're all good. So. Okay. Although, actually, no, this needs to flip. Oh no, no, never mind. It already happened. We're good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because it moves after. Mm -hmm. It moves after it does the thing. Okay. So I'm gonna move. I've got a clear path. Move and capture with this single card. It's pretty sweet. That's awesome. Uh, is an obvious choice and then um i think i'll flip this one i'm trying to find more shelves so i'll flip this one terror and it's blocked this one oh no that's not good S scott how do you pronounce this um how do you pronounce this one? No, like Scylla. and uh the other one is um I'm going to get pretentious and do the real Greek. It's Haribidis. Hanabidis. Oh, wow. Haribidis. <laughs> wow. I'm practicing uh, pronouncing all those yokai. Uh, yeah. <laughs> my, yeah. Mom is, my mom is Greek, so actually I'm cheating. I, I have to pronounce things like badger. <laughs> so I could um, make it so people can get to this one. For now, that seems yeah, like that's useful. Connect it all. So I want to turn it counterclockwise. How we be these? Our turns it clockwise. <laughs> Shift it's our turns it counterclockwise. I heard somebody pronounce it uh, Charybdis once, and I was like, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, no, that's how I would have done it. Mm -hmm, Hundred <laughs> percent. <laughs> It's Greek's fault for having so many stupid syllables, to be honest. That's true. Mm -hmm. It really should have been a better civilization. Hanavidis? <laughs> Hanavidis? Is what you ha. said? How we be these? Yeah, yeah, that's right. <laughs> what it says in the chat. <laughs> Wait, in the chat? I don't see anything. How we be these? Max, oh, how, how we, we be, be these? these. That's there pretty close, go. actually. <laughs> <laughs> it's good enough. But it's got that horrible guttural huh at the beginning. It... Okay. <laughs> okay, and now I need to do this thing. Yeah. Uh, it's empty, so it's flipped. And this one moves down. Got it. Cool. Back to you now, Amanda. Okay, now I'm ready super ready um i was looking at the cards that i have versus what i need and i basically have one for each i don't have any pinks that's my big problem here if you take a pink card you know you'll get at least one right that, I can, but... that that makes sense but i didn't do that that's <laughs> you can now though if you want to. oh i can i can draw you're right mm -hmm. Although, or I could flip over more tiles. Although yes. it's only adjacent to where I am, so it's just this one. And that's by the danger danger tile, so I maybe well, not. That's okay. true. Yeah, it might be better not to do that right yeah, now. I'm not going to not gonna but do that. I'm going to draw one of these, yeah. Are we waiting for somebody to capture the basilisk, or is that something you can do? Uh, let me see. Uh, star, blue, purple. Star. You could do that. with Yeah. These. Yeah. If you want, I don't know if anybody uh, called dibs on the basilisk yet, but 
I have nothing. No, to I don't think so. I, I could get it with Alice and Sophia Dulip Singh. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Okay, I'm going to stack these together. Pop this on here. Grab that guy. Here you go. I think you need Jenny Weasley to do that, but I mean. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? She couldn't show up, so I'm here instead. <laughs> and oh, and then... this is another next to the curse to flip. Yeah, it is. So you, I, I mean, just, I can I, so that was one move or one move, and then moving the basilisk over was two moves. If it's, it's occupied, oh, okay, cool. Like if you flip it over and it is a terror, and you fill the you fill it with a terror, it'll be occupied, so it'll just rotate, which might even be good for us. Oh, flip to dark can happen if it's a good tile, and the cur the curse can flip to dark the chest and the shelf tiles. Yeah, which so that's how they get flipped to dark sometimes. Yeah, which is good because you can flip them back. Right. Right, because they repopulate. I don't think it would be a terrible thing for you to flip it over, but it's up to you. Um, it's more Doing scary it. to have an empty terror tile next to the curse than a full one. Boop. Okay, let's see what happened. Oh, look at that. Hey, hell yeah. You got a chest. So if we land on that, we get to take a reward. Okay, so then that was move two, or was that move three? Two? Two. Two. Cool. So then oh, I yeah, can yeah. pop over here and get the chest. What um, happens to me if I'm on the on the tile when the terror does the thing? I don't Wait, think it would you be die a, in real life. It would be the same thing, the, the rotation. <laughs> oh, it's just the rotation. <laughs> it's it, being filled is means a pawn or a terror or... Um, a shelf so, that's, that's no matter big. what it's filled because it has a thing in it so if i right. stand on it it's essentially the same thing got you it would, yeah, it's gonna rotate but you would get rotated 90 degrees yeah mm -hmm. i don't know what to do about that uh i'm gonna take it nope wrong spot Flip. being rotated 90 degrees wouldn't be too bad no, not too bad connect <laughs> things up it's a good perspective yay all right that was one cool. two three i think that's it then a curse Da -da, da -da, da -da. Red Perfect. here, flip there, easy peasy. Ooh, shelf. Cool. And that takes one of these. Boop, boop, boop. The pink. Cool. Who's, All right. got a, who's got a classic fiction monster we can drop in there? <laughs> in where? I'm not carrying the a shelf here, the pink one. Oh, pit the pendulum to go there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Good I'm call. starting to see the uh, the overlap, which is cool. Yeah, how pit and the pendulum is both classic fiction. Is it children's fiction though? Is it? <laughs> I don't know. I read that book when I was like nine, so maybe. <laughs> uh, Touche. Yeah, that's fair. I, I, <laughs> I guess it's all children's fiction if you're brave enough. Fairy <laughs> <laughs> um, tales are some... pretty disturbing. Yeah. And then what's the other one? Uh, historical anything. leaders. Cool. All right. Yeah, that's okay, fun. Sorry, I like this. This is probably a lot of fun to design and make these connections between characters and and literature and history. I want to see the spreadsheet that this game is on. I bet it's <laughs> yes. massive. Oh, All right. Yeah. So, Amanda, you're finished. It's over to me. Uh, I did three turns, and that's and okay. then I turned over a curse, so that should be it. I think you All need right. to move this. Down. Yeah, oh, down yeah. One. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. That, that is correct. the last bit. So we've got I two, will continuously forget that. I already we've got know. two. I think we're calling these libraries with books in them or shelves, open shelves. Yeah, these are shelves. And the whole thing is one, the library. There's only one monster, and it's the How We Be This, uh, <laughs> which I cannot deal with. So because I can't, I guess it's I'm just going too hard to, to pronounce. Yeah, I, I can't. I can't deal with it. We're supposed to fight it. <laughs> um, I'm gonna get books. I'm gonna go find some allies to help me. Um, how we so be this? We, you said <laughs> how we be these. Uh, so how we beat book this? Cards, if I pick up a red <laughs> book, if I pick up a children's fiction, am I like more likely to find a that kind of attribute? The, you, the will red attribute? you will get. You will get at least one. Right? Okay. Um, so yeah, I I could come for that thing and but and it doesn't uh, have any cards on it though. You want the pink is what you're thinking. Is that what you yeah, mean? Yeah, I want some pink. I'm going to get some classic fiction to deal with that. Uh, that's that's my first tough, action. That's a tough monster. It needs four. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm going to take another one. OK. 
Okay. One more classic fiction. I'm looking for the, the right card here. Nope, just one of each. Okay, so... Well, you can use your spear to fi finish it off. Yeah, it's just a three-card combo, but I yeah, can do it. Sucks. I can do it. I was trying to be a little more efficient, because over here I got Wahoo Mul I got Mulan, who's just straight, straight oh, legend know? all the way down. <laughs> Proper accurate. legend. Yeah. Obviously, <laughs> somebody this has whole... a double. I her, her I, I know this is well past the design maybe stage, we... but the... oh, you used it already, maybe. I really want her to be tough as a raging water, mysterious as a great typhoon, and <laughs> I'm missing one here. Those... Mysterious <laughs> is the dark side of the moon. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. All the force. She needs force of a great typhoon. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah there yeah. it is. God, that movie's so good. That would be nice. <laughs> it really is. It's just it's, it's not just in print yet, so you could you could it's message it. Not too them. late. <laughs> No, okay, now that you're watching this here, after the fact, here's what you need to do. You're not to get feedback on this game. <laughs> this is, the very literary Other designers really of this are going to be like, ah, oh, disgusting. They want the musical <laughs> here, Philistines. Strength of a Raging River. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with my last action. I can't deal with He's anything so without being super. You know what? I'm going to try something different. I'm going to pass it to you. I'm going to pass my last action oh, yeah. over to tim so tim you get four actions your turn well after yeah. i deal with the curse hell yeah you guys saw that ashley was right right okay cool just checking <laughs> i did see that yes okay good all right uh this gets flipped from the curse Ooh, hey that's got? good we get books this is good for us uh it is amazing the amazing mind. icon and then the curse moves and it's over to you tim you get four actions Four actions. What am I going to yeah, do with all this? Congratulations on your gift of analysis paralysis I've given you. <laughs> this bounty that I've been given. Um, yeah, you, you're the one that has the card that can double your cards. I can. That's the one that if Michael had it, it would be easier to not waste a card, basically. Can I get to him and give it to him? I can, right? Yeah, probably. Uh, you're blue. You could go like okay, that. Okay, so it's a one, then... move act, one, one action to move. Yeah, this or or he could give you his card. Like if uh is oh, there one that I'm more sad. if you had one that had blue and pink, which is this one. That would be all you needed. That plus Whoa, your card. Oh yeah, you're right. Good read. Yeah, okay, let's do that. Why don't we trade? Um Yeah, I can give you Elizabeth. Because we're just uh, we're just hanging out here at the beginning. We're not going anywhere. Yeah, that's fine. Well we can trade a character card and then I can run up with my photocopier and um yeah and i think and michael can just Stilla. i don't think you have to trade i you can uh can, actually i'm not even sure if you're allowed to trade i think it's just to give a material it's i don't know maybe we better read that again i am checking sure. the rules right now because we're a bunch of cheaters yeah uh, i don't want to cheat yes. donate yeah. receive swap exchange a single card or multiple cards with one other player exchange <laughs> you may Guess give right a us. card or take a card or swap cards you must be standing on the same tile okay so we we're on rule one we're here okay. together in the same tile cool. we can swap as many cards as we want to okay um, um we should uh, you should take uh oh man there's not even a chance shaharazad um, thank you you, sh you should take I learned her. that from Magic the Gathering, <laughs> not reading. <laughs> you know what? It doesn't matter how you learned it. It's fine. <laughs> uh, but yes. I've I read some of A Thousand and One Nights, and I probably just read all the names in my brain. <laughs> never mm -hmm. never had to say them out loud. No. Um, so take take Shara. If and... I grab her, um, and if you want to if you want to take Elizabeth, if you need her for anything, she's got a couple uh, of unique traits there. Um, that is fine by me. No, I can I can hang on to her. I I'm, think I'm okay for now. All right. I don't so know what I need yet, so you might as well. It's two actions, so I'm going to run up and capture this old yeah. this guy. I'm going to play the photocopier, um, and I'm going to double up Scheherazade to snag him. So cool. That's actually three. I still have one more, um, which is hilarious. Uh, I guess I can. And you dump can him also in. pass if you want. Pass it. That's true. Uh, is there any danger of holding the book, the the stuff in our hands? I guess our hand size goes down. Yeah. So you, you just could 
this. You could release a, a terror into a, a book if you wanted to. Yeah, into a bookshelf. True. I could. Got it's funny, I, can, I technically took this path to get here. Um, but I want to drop... So, are we saving this blue for anything special? Does no, I, we I, couldn't decide. That's we, uh, we might we could get in a place where you want to start shelving things, and we can't because the curse is messing with things and breaking our paths and putting new terrors in the way. Right. Okay. This, the one that has a green on it is probably worth saving, but now that you have this other one that has a blue and a pink, we know where both the blue and pink are. You can get to blue immediately. Yeah. My vote would be shelving that blue one. Yeah. Okay, cool. So I'll use my fourth action to shelve my Greek monsters uh, in the blue section. You were the one who really knew how to pronounce it, and <laughs> you were, yeah, you're the only one who was allowed before. to attack it. The monster was like, "I'm very impressed. <laughs> <laughs> I will follow you." <laughs> Well, it's a hell of a turn, um, and I get a reward for that. Ooh. Yep. Oh, hell yeah. Strange women, lion and pawns, distributing swords. It's not an efficient <laughs> system of government, but I'll take it anyway. <laughs> exactly. Um, and I'll do the curse. Uh, okay, so it's occupied, so it goes 90 degrees. Which wasn't bad because we couldn't get it to it anyway. We right? couldn't reach it anyway, so. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna center this so it's easier to see the uh, the paths. Okay. Cool. Mm-hmm. I don't want to walk through any walls. Okay. Well, I a lot of flipping needs to happen. I'm the green player. Okay. I'll yep. I'll go ahead and flip this one where I am. Okay. Treasure chest. Treasure's good. And. I'm thinking flip this one, like move move here so that I can flip this one. Move and yeah. flip. Yes. Oops, no, 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 no. Not oh, the Oh, you cease to exist. Myself. <laughs> there you are, you're back. Okay. Oh. That would be a perfect game over. Oh no, you ceased to exist. <laughs> yes. Okay, we have another green one now. So. Whoa, Jabberwocky uh, is a... Uh, very high expectations from us. Oh my god, that is horrible. Uh, yeah. That totally tracks. Mm -hmm. And curse. Claws that bite. Okay, it's a full tile crunch. that goes 90 degrees clockwise. This is this is one thing that's just a little bit okay, it it's gonna go clockwise automatically. Yeah, okay. It's hard right. to remember. It's like With the rotate just and R, just R is clockwise. Shift R is counterclockwise. Yeah. And if you hit oh. it when it's wrong, and then it's like different than it just used to be, you're like, oh, how was it? I'm not cheating, am I? You know what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> to yeah. me, it can be hard for me to hold that memory of what it used right. to look like spatially. But okay, that was my turn, and it's back to Amanda. Hey. So we're gonna have to team up to take out the Jabberwocky. Yeah, yeah I think how it's do brutal. we team up? Because I still don't have any pinks. Like, so I, I have a spear that deals with the two blue. Okay. Um, this may be useful. Oh, yeah, also, you have a lot we, of green. Maybe we, maybe I have two greens if, with my Hypatia. What if we ignore the Jabberwocky? Is this an option? I mean, he's yeah. kind of insistent, but maybe. For for now, there's only one terror out on the board, so we're not in but I can't trouble, move but... past him if I wanted to go through that way, right? Uh, you could build you could go through this way. here. Oh, okay. You could go around. You couldn't get yeah. here. Right. But, but we could I, rotate some things. You, oh, is that there. what you're wanting to do, though? You're wanting to put that away? Know. Maybe. Potentially. That, I mean, that seems to be the thing to do, but maybe what, not. What do we have? We've got a pit and a pendulum, which is a single monster. <laughs> How you're carrying that is beyond me. Um, <laughs> there's a basilisk. Scale model. <laughs> yeah. And there is an entire forest of thorns. I'm waiting yes. for the heart to open up to drop a forest in it. Okay, so yeah. Okay. So we, we have, have we only need one more thing to. Uh, okay, so we're looking so, for purple, green, so pink, and red. Ideally, my basilisk could go in the purple spot. Really. Yeah, that'd actually be fine. Purple. I think. 
Yeah. So Let's what I'm going to do for Forest my first action green. is to come around this way and hang out here and then click this. So that was one. Yeah. Clicking this and flipping this is two. And that's a bad guy. Bow, bow. Boop, boop. Never mind. Uh, okay. Hmm. That's a problem. Yep. Mari Lude. Got mirror. Mari Lude. Uh, oh wait, I have two hearts and halfway there. How many is that? Two purples. I have one purple, and so then my last one would have to be a trade, or I can give the next person my last turn, right? Correct. Yeah, you can pass a action. Okay. Um, yeah, it does um, seem like. Can do can she pass me? Can Amanda pass me her basilisk and all associated basilisk keepers? That would make sense. That that is cards in Let's her hand. Is it Hold not? on, I'm gonna look. Well, but it's a terror too. It's not just cards, and that's never meant. Terrors are not mentioned in uh, donate receive swap. Clarifications. Oh, yeah. oh, hang on. It says here, you cannot pass captured terrors between players in the terror <laughs> section of the rules. There you okay. go. You're yeah. faster than me. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, whoever wants to capture this no. Mari Lude with, uh, that has two purples, I have this mirror mirror on the wall with two hearts. And you, by your forces combined, you can take off with that. And <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, hey. Now, you have, now not you have, for you. Uh, Amanda. Do you have huh. enough actions? You don't. You have this library ladder. You can sneak past the terror. <gasps> oh, shit. Well, there it is. Except, except that your way is blocked. Yeah, you got to turn the thing twice. You have to rotate it uh, one uh -huh. time. Oh, just once, actually. Yeah, just once. Right. But you only have one action left, right? So I can only rotate. So I might as well just use my last action to rotate then. Yeah, so that other you'll people make can that. go through. There you go. Uh, as long, well, the one thing is. Yeah. It, maybe it's okay because it's a three-way thing. This could get rotated by the curse. Yeah. But even if it does, it'll still be. Well, maybe not. I really. You could just save that maybe... action or pass it if you, because you, it's not going to benefit you yet anyway. Yeah. No. Okay. I'm going to pass my action. I, I bequeath unto you my next oh, action. Let's come back around. <laughs> I think we forgot to move this because Man. eight cards are here. It started here. One, yep. two, three. That makes four, sense. Five. Six, seven, eight. Yeah, yep. this will be eight. Okay, good so, call. So that's actually... Actually. Yep. Adjacent. All right, so do you want me to rotate it instead? Since uh, we're... Yeah, I sure. Because you're right? standing right by it. That makes sense. I'm okay, okay with that. Take that. Right, that way. Or, wait, who has the two purple cards? I, do oh, I wait, have no, it's two I have a two, I have a two purple. Um, you do card with if the I, mirror you could solo your mirror i could do that yeah yeah okay so i might Can just you... train you my mirror mirror because that would be more effective where's the uh, clarifications we have to move to where i am first where are you i'm right here oh so that would be another action then huh yeah heck but okay. you could get to where i am so that when it's my turn i can trade with you if you want Yes. It, 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 it kind of doesn't matter what order. All, all the things have to happen. To me, it doesn't seem clear, like, whether rotate first or... Well, like, actually, if... No, no, no. Well, no, it doesn't matter, because moving... I'll... Yeah. If I move to you, I'll be next to it. Mm -hmm. But... If you rotate it... And I... Yeah, I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't think it makes a difference. Okay. If you do any of those things. No, I'm... Um... Mm. All right, cool. <laughs> no, I'm going to stick with my initial feeling and give my last turn to the next person. All and right. End my turn now, but I have to do the curse bit. <clears throat> yes. So hold, please. Bam, bam, bam. And we're going to click this guy and flip it over. Woohoo. No. That's, that's three. That's three, and it is a tornado, just a straight up. It's like just a in, tornado. We're in Twister. <laughs> well, I uh, see the Toto house, that's house, over though. there as yes. well. It's yes. not just any tornado. It has sucked up a small dog and a Monopoly house. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, Monopoly dog and house. Yeah. <laughs> 
So what is that? Yellow, pink, purple. I do... Oh, I could do that. I could take the tornado. Ooh, Feels cool. like a waste of Mulan's power, but I, you know... <laughs> You know, it's I don't know so if you guys have seen Centaur World, but like a tornado there is pretty intense. So, <laughs> is this path blocked? It is not. And then we really want to put the basilisk uh, to home in the purple power place because it can't go anywhere else. The pink, we've already used the blue and the yellow. So, wait a minute. It, there is no way to get to the tornado without tornado turning. Tornado is blocked things. currently. Uh, <laughs> right, yeah, not without rotating. You're, you're red. Okay. But I agree that Basilisk should probably go into purple because he's been locked out of his other two spaces. Yeah. <clears throat> it's a tornado. Yeah, thank you. I was pronouncing yet another word wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> uh, so where do I want to go? I've got so many actions. Okay, so for action one... I'm going to rotate this because of all of our indecision. It has been done. Um, I am with yellow, so I could trade with you with yeah, your you permission. Want two reds? Yeah. Uh, does it help me? Not terribly. I'm, I still need... I'm the one who wants your mirror. I oh, think. that's right. That's right. So uh, I've got uh, the two greens and a blue, which would help with the Jabberwocky. Yeah. Because you had pinks, right? Maybe I should go over there and just pick up a treasure chest. Or maybe, wait, what do I want? I can take care of Heather. Are you, is your, are your sights on this spooky horse? I mean, only if it's easier <laughs> for me than for you. Uh, if I had the mirror, I could do it with two cards. Yeah. With the mirror and one yeah, of yeah, my yeah. cards. But if you can do it faster than me. No. Like I think it's probably getting to be kind of important that we get one of those terrors off the board so yeah. it doesn't start getting one, out of control. Two. On, on I can much. with my last three turns I can go grab that tornado. Uh, okay. And it doesn't mess up the world too bad. By so by rotating go. this one to kind of create a door. Yeah, exactly. Oh wait, guess and, what I did? I didn't move the little beep boop. Okay. Sorry, oh. I'm doing that now. Okay, nice. Yeah, I think I think that's probably <laughs> the best thing to do, because like yeah. you said, we gotta start picking them up, and mm -hmm. then we gotta start bringing them home. But that's that's next turn's problem. So it's one, <laughs> two, and oh. three. Well, it doesn't matter. I don't think you're supposed to turn it when you're standing on it, but it's the same diff because yeah, you would yeah, yeah, here, yeah, rotate, then, turn then it move from here to adjacent here. to it. Yeah. Cool. All right, and I get the tornado. It takes a lot. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. It takes these two. It takes Joe and Mulan, the unlikely <laughs> the woman team up. Yeah, they uh, are a pretty unlikely duo. <laughs> yes, but they did what Dorothy Ann never could. <laughs> <laughs> they defeated that tornado, and uh, that's it. I'm gonna do the curse. Ooh, it's doing... Oh, no. I'm stranded. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Hmm. I'm trapped in the dark. I'm so very was afraid. A, it was an empty <laughs> other tile, and it got flipped. Okay. Yes, correct. It was an empty tile, and it got flipped. And I am all alone in the dark with these eyes underneath me. But it's okay. <laughs> bad. We are cool. <laughs> Sounds we are crazy. all right. <laughs> Everything is gravy. Go ahead, Tim. All right. What am I doing here? Okay, first of all, I'm going to try to free you. Freedom! I'll flip that over. Um, that curse is going to flip it straight back, isn't it? It That's might. That's exactly what I just thought. <laughs> oh, yeah. It, totally it possible. Might. It might. That's okay. I'm here, too. It's fine. Okay, so I, I can see the light again for a minute, and I appreciate it. So the Jabberwocky is a real threat. Um, where are we going to try? I guess I try to get something st some stuff. Cause, so I have science already let's go with like classic the, fiction maybe the card other than the one that i'm gonna use i want to use for this is pretty mm -hmm. boss for the jabberwocky too it's three blues and a green wow yeah oh that'd be great for the jabberwocky i can throw i can give you, you elizabeth i still um, vote we ignore the jabberwocky if we can get around it 
because it's not blocking any of our paths and we don't have to kill it to beat the game we already have enough uh mm, true well it's blocking the path to pink. Markers. i guess we can get to no, pink we can rotate this rotate. one yeah. yeah and yeah so so can anybody okay so actually um well it's just yeah it's the pinks that are missing for the right like, yeah heather you can fight it kind of as Actually, no, you still need you still need classics. You still need the pink ones, huh? All right. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, one thing that we do really need is the other... Red, We're not yeah, going to be able to win revealing. without these two shelves coming out. So, like, uncovering more tiles and figuring out where their shelves are is key, I think, too. Okay, it. yeah, let's start exploring them. And, and you can... You don't have to be... You don't have to have a way through. You can just flip this one. You can oh. take through the bookshelves. Interesting. Okay, it's just cool. Just being adjacent to you is all. It's important. So I'll flip that. Darn it, Tim. Okay. Yeah, sorry, folks. <laughs> the, ah, Literally the plague. Unleash the plague on us. That's my bad. No, we don't need another one. That's my bad. <laughs> no yeah, too soon. Too more. soon. All right. So <laughs> I, I messed up. I accidentally released a plague. It happens. <laughs> I think we can all move past it now. I'm going to. <laughs> if you just ignore it, it's going to go away, right? Yeah, just pretend it's not there. We did it, folks. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Um, okay, so in preparation for plague, I'm going to grab myself a science textbook. Like it? No, idea. that's not going to do anything. Hey, I did it. <laughs> yeah, lots of science. Hey, what do you mean it doesn't help? What do you mean? <laughs> Grab some of that Oregon fiction. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I guess that's three. Get, woke. <laughs> Get that curtain. Let's see what happens. Oh, um, my God. Oh, it oh is my. that one. Oh my God, how annoying. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> I okay. tried. I'm sorry. Hello, darkness, <laughs> my old friend. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, my turn, though, I can go where Amanda is. One. Yeah, come hang out with me. Two. And I think that's all I want to take from you. And Do you want anything from me? Actually, maybe you should get this. I mean, it would be whatever helpful you for like. Jabberwocky. Okay. I don't know. I mean, you have really... actually a lot of that same thing, though. Maybe I shouldn't do that. Oh, man! Hey, I, I also, like smart girls, so <laughs> I also have a I have a shield and a mirror that together without even a person. But I don't know. I I like this person. She's gonna take the mirror. Yeah, I mean, if if you want either the shield or um, I mean this person, I'm not exactly sure what you would use it for, but I would have an needs, awesome shield to hold in front of me no matter what. The plague and it's from, so, I'm gonna say it wrong, but it's I'll like Boudica or Bodica, something like that. Yeah, the original English queen, way, way, way back in the way back machine. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And then I'll capture this one. Curse. Is anyone else vibing to this music? Okay. It's so this... good. I'm really, I'm feeling it. It's a. So it's going to rotate, rotate 90 degrees clockwise. Perfect. Okay. No problem. That's super that what right we right? wanted. We didn't want to go hang out with that thing anyway. We didn't want to no. hang out with the plague. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for quarantining that. <laughs> right. Good right. job. <laughs> Smart. That makes sense. Okay. Your turn. All right. Ready. So. Now that I'm here, step one, flip. There you go. <laughs> it's okay. It's step okay. Two. Don't 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 flip that for me. I'll open it myself if I need it. I mean, you might have to if this thing keeps well, on doing this stuff. We got to check all these tiles over here. So I was going to start walking that way, opening stuff. We have to way. check them because we might be very close to. We've got the pink we, one showing, and we've we we got... have to find two more. So we got to flip a lot of tiles. I mean, although the could, fact that you flip this one, Amanda, may, means you could go over here and flip this good. one. If you that's can what come help. Yeah, I, I appreciate it. I don't okay. want to discourage you. No, easily discouraged. 
<laughs> I'm glad to see the the light of day yet again. Oh, that is where the plague is. It's okay. It can't. It can't oh. get through. It can't chase you. Mm -hmm. Don't be scared. <laughs> <laughs> I've tried to have logic. I know what, if the, what if the shelf is here? Oh my god. Okay, it might I'm gonna be. do it. it might I'm gonna be. flip it. Okay, so I flipped that one. I moved, <clears throat> and this is my flip. This is my last action. Uh, it's terror, night terrors. Oh, whoa, how many is that? That is three. Oh, that's yeah, three. three. We're good. We're good. Oh, what is oh, this? Nice and easy. Triffids? Piece of cake. Cute. I have no idea what this is a reference to. I am very curious now. Now I'm going to spend like three hours after this looking this up on like Wikipedia and then YouTube and then some like super niche website that's from 1998 or so. <laughs> I just Googled it. Um, yeah. It's a, uh, it's from the book uh, The Day of the Triffids, a 1951 sci-fi novel by John Wyndham and they're like walking Ooh. plant monsters and it inspired a whole bunch of like B-movies and stuff. It looks really cool. Oh, that sounds fun. Is this like Maybe what night. the second Goblins movie is based on? <laughs> that movie is based on a fever dream. You know what I'm talking about, right? Like, <laughs> yeah, I was yeah. eating him, and now they're next. They're gonna eat me. This is this is the thing. Flip to dark. Okay, so I have to flip this <laughs> treasure tile over to the other side, and that's the end of my turn. All right, ready, set, go. Okay. Uh, no one's looked in this corner yet. Nope, not yet. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> we can start capturing Bad, stuff. We're, we're Decisions screwed. were made. Oh, 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 it's a baddie. Oh, I'm God. Well. It's the big boy. Um, it's the more of the art. This is a, the, the more final Triffid art. Meow, meow. Ooh. There, there's the Triffid. Ooh. Beautiful. Love it. Oh. So, as you can see, like, this is what the cards look like when they're really, really finished. A lot of them just have the silhouettes, so they're working mm -hmm. on the art for those. Anyway, I mean, it All seems right. like of everything, the artwork is the hardest part of finishing a game and actually getting everything to be cohesive and it's tricky. Looking the same in the same style and the getting it all done <laughs> eventually. <laughs> yeah. There's yeah. There's a lot of different things that are hard in different ways. Board games are. Bear to make, yeah, oh, it's, it's amazing that people still <laughs> want to make them because they're like super duper duper hard to make. You have to write a technical manual that people can understand when you're not there. You have to, yeah, uh, wrangle artists, you have to deal with a physical product that connected log not. logistical shipping and all that sort of thing. Mm -hmm. I might wide shipping and VAT, blah 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 blah. Like it just goes on and on. Pain and in on the Is it gonna yeah. hurt? Your feelings if I go stick a tornado where the basilisk was going to go? No, I guess not that, at all. I guess that could be pink. I'm just looking for things to do to move the board along. No, no, absolutely another, go do that. Do we sure. have another pink we're holding right now? The Forest of Thorns is not pink. The pendulum. <laughs> the yeah, yeah, no, we're good. We're good. Uh, I think go the ahead. Forest of Thorns it, is the It strands the basilisk, but... We don't have... That's okay. Me and him have been hanging yeah, out. We're kind of having a good time. Like, we're buddies yeah. now. <laughs> I, I don't I don't want to keep opening doors, because that could lose the game. And Fair. Yeah, um, we want to save this one for the green, because it's the only monster that has green that we've captured. So... yeah. I guess mine could be. I guess the tornado could be pink, which we're waiting on. No, oh, pink's right yeah. here. We have it. I mean, it. I could get it to the pink top. Oh, and the basilisk only can go to purple. I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So, can I rotate something with this map? No, I'm. I'm afraid to flip anything. Uh. Right. Let's do. It's real scary. Oh wait, here I could do this. One, two, three, four. I'm gonna slip through here using my sneaky library card thing. Your library ladder. Nice. Yeah. Okay. And uh, tornado to pink. That's what we'll do. Yeah, that's great. It does. Hmm. I will be spending some quality time with this Jabberwocky henceforth, but I am going to. You have some. You have another tile you could have flipped over to. Yeah, but not yet, because it's because we right. can lose. Where does right. this go? It goes here. Um, and I get this out of my hand. Goodbye, tornado. Mm -hmm. um, pink. Pink. Goodbye, Mulan. And Joe. 
Uh, do those go in the same pile? No, those go somewhere different, don't they? Yeah, they, they no, they can down. just go in the same discard. Oh, it doesn't matter. Uh, it's gonna be a nightmare when we have to manually clean all those up. Oh wait, we don't have to. It's That's the same. <laughs> <It's> amazing. <laughs> uh, and I get a prize. I win a treasure chest, a reward. Yes. Oh, it's a time machine. That's yeah. gonna be useful. I got mm -hmm. a blue phone booth. Um, can I get one more Ooh. turn? The other one is cool. The trolley right. service. What yeah, they switch to swap with they, anybody. You just oh, get cool. like one of those library trolleys and you put something on it and push it to your friend, you know. So trade it with anyone or swap a player with a... Yes, okay. So you can trade with anyone anywhere. Use the little things at the... Uh, at the Vacuum um, tubes. The bank, yeah. <laughs> or uh, or I can take an extra turn, which is cool. Um, I'm going to read a book, I think, and then pass it over. Or, hey, do you need an extra action, Tim? Otherwise, I can just read a book. Um, I would never say no to it, but take a book. Take a book. You have, your hand is tiny. I don't even know what I'm going to do with it yet. All I got is this Jabberwocky. I don't even know what book I want. All right, I'll take this book. Uh, yeah, because I got lots of blue. All right, that's my turn. I'm going to do the curse. It is oh, hold this on, tile. Hold on, hold on. Wait. Uh oh. We have 13. It should be here. There were 13 before you did that. It should be here. Thank you. Uh, guys, this may be bad news. Uh, yeah, there's nothing but terrors there. Oh, yeah. That, yeah that's that's horrible gonna happen. I think it's this inevitable. Is game losing bad news, is it not? Is, is it? No, we need six. No, when we have Four, six. Five. Oh, yeah. Okay. Whew, yeah, so, so we, we just can't stuff. screw up and, and get the bottom left next time. I unnecessarily yeah. had all the stress of being one tear away from losing, and now I do actually deserve that stress. <laughs> and I get to run it out for another round. You preemptively worried about the worry that you were going to have to worry about later when you were yeah. going to be worrying. Like, <laughs> All right, well, my turn's over, so I have no more worries. Go ahead, Tim. <laughs> <laughs> Problem solved. It's on you, buddy. All right, I'm going to maybe try to capture the big bad wolf, okay. right? I mean, we gotta get, we got, we gotta, we gotta clear some of this. We gotta clear something, or we're toast. Yeah, you could do the big bad wolf with the Alice Ball and the. But sword. I can't reach him because of the stupid rotation. Well, you can rotate something. You could, oh, you could, oh yeah, yeah. You, it's something that it's you're. It's gonna be really. It's gonna take move. me. Oh, actually, this is perf. Well, it would be good for you to be right here, actually, because then the the square would be filled. Actually, it's it better maybe rotate. for you to not Good. capture it because this would be an empty square. So it's you impossible could, for it to trigger a uh, could, another tear. You could, yeah, yeah, you could move here and right. rotate the, oh, wait a minute. Hmm. No, you need to rotate this. Yeah, I have to hit it twice, though. and that would Oh, be... no, you move here, rotate this so you'll be able to get to it. Just stand there. You're standing here, and this is filling that, and so we know... What about a the Venus flytraps? Can you deal with those? Green, um, pink, yellow? I mean, this is a really good move because it no. protects us from another terror coming out. If you're standing here and this terror is still here, it's just that I guess you're not removing something, but you're keeping... Like, <laughs> if you capture this and then we get the curse, just fill it again, it's like you, you know might what? as well have not captured it. It's just taking up a space in your hand. That is a really valid point. Um, okay, cool. So one action will be to move. Maybe I will rotate it so that I can eventually capture it. So when you rotate, do you have yeah, to do David, it? David, I'm learning no, so much. I have either way. Just I can roll it a mile long now. You are right, David. <laughs> I'll put it there. So hmm, it's very tempting to capture it because I can. <laughs> you can and pass if... your action. Is maybe what you should do because it's better for you to be standing here. Right. The the problem is. We're can put back in the one, same spot. If we a can't. new one comes out, we lose. You could rotate the tear next to you out. like this, and then it you can have a pathway open to go elsewhere. Well, and if he captures it you. three three out of four of the times, we don't go back to five terrors, and we're back at yeah. four, which means we actually are allowed to flip tiles, which is what we have to do to win. Where like is Will when is we that, need to calculate probability? Like, so my fear is that if I don't take this, right. somebody starts flipping tiles to find a shelf and then reveal the terror and then we lose. Yeah, I think you should mm -hmm. take the big bad wolf. I think I have to take him anyway. Okay. That makes sense. 
Okay, so I'll, I see Alice your point, Heather, but I feel like it just kind of stalls us out. Eventually, I'll, I'll we have to take it. Team up just, Alice yeah. with the sword. Because you'll still be filling this spot. This one spot is going to be the open spot. Yeah, it's it. it we yeah. could hit it, but it's odds are we don't. <laughs> I and don't do, even know who Alice breaking. Ball is. <laughs> but if we do, we're breaking even. No, no, it was one of the. It's Alice Ball, but it's a misspelling. It's fine. It's on oh, here. Oh, okay. Okay. That's yeah. the newest one we turned over. That oh, okay. Up. Yeah. She gives the sword. Got the wolf. Okay, I'll 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 keep it as as. Oh, the. To that. This is the one you're talking about, right, David? Leprosy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Autocorrect screws up everybody's life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We could. We I got made, you. I we learned our lessons with octagons and hexagons earlier in the night. So. <laughs> <Right. laughs> We're like, shapes totally. are cool. They're the best. Okay. <laughs> Ready. Let's see if... Oh, you're standing here, though. Because you went and captured it. So you're here. That's where it was. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I have to go... Oh, right. I went to it to capture it. Okay, yeah. So he's there. Yeah. I'll be back in two seconds. All right. So strategy time. We have to flip these things in the corners because there's two hidden rooms. Wait, I forgot. I have to do the curse, don't I? <laughs> Alice good, Paul David. is almost it's for good, sure David. a uh, oh, uh, awesome. host on Great British Bake Off. Sorry, folks. Oh, <laughs> dang <laughs> it. I told you. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, that's unlucky. That was bad luck. Yeah, it's, it's okay. Bad. It's just some spider webs. We can get it. It's exactly Man, okay. what we were expecting. This is not unexpected in the least. Come on. And now I'm passing my turn. Sorry, folks. <laughs> um, spider webs. We're about to lose. Uh, uh. Okay, well, this one's actually okay. 12, 13, 14, 15. This is where it is. It's gonna, it's gonna turn one of these for us. Yeah, which is it kind could of be a monster. Good. Could be a monster. We need to check up there anyway. We've got to eventually flip yeah. this tile. Okay, so, so should we focus really... on trying to fix the monsters over here? I. Uh, so and, if I ta okay. if I can get a monster on my turn or a terror on my turn, then we know we're not going to lose when the curse goes. Or when we start. We might not. We, we might get lucky and rooms. just not lose when the curse goes if I do some other things. Or, yeah, and I'm not really able to. Um, uh oh, I'm gonna. Oh, I'm no. gonna, gonna give a second here. Thanks. Angie, baby. <laughs> uh, Tim has night. the cutest baby I've <laughs> ever seen. Uh, I've seen this baby on Facebook. <laughs> okay. This baby could be the Gerber baby. <laughs> Um, I believe you. <laughs> uh, anyway, so, but I, I can't get anything with what I have. I would have to use some turns to get some take cards, and even then, green, is there green, something green. blue and green? I have, I have uh, blues and greens, but I don't know that. Heather, if you drop off your um, one of your well, monsters, I'll get a reward. You'll get a reward that and could then... be a two for one action. It progresses us and maybe gets you okay. what you need. Legit. Seems like that is the first thing I should do. Yeah, you should. Yeah, do it. Do it. That. Maybe we get lucky here, and if nothing else, if we lose, at least we feel like we made more progress. Right. It's not about whether you win or lose. It's the friends you make along the way. <laughs> it's the Something historic like characters that. you meet along the way. Yes, the historic characters you learn about, learn about, and then you're like, "How do you pronounce that?" Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> right. The foreign languages you learn along the way. Yes. Okay, well, perfect. I mean, we're looking for shelves. I could flip this, but we might just lose. Yeah. When that happens. Yeah, that's the thing. Do it. So, how many? <laughs> ooh, ooh, can we play? Can we play numbers? Do we know how many uh, ooh, I'm so uh, one of these, tiles sorry. there are? How many baddie tiles there are? Oh yeah, we could we could math it out. 
but there are extra pieces up here in this area. Oh no. Yeah, and I don't... so then you can't really. Well, they're, they're supposed to be there, you know what they are, and you use them to adjust Make the it harder difficulty. or easier. Okay. Yeah. But so I do don't remember know what those are? how many there are of each thing. Does it say in the rules what the base game, like what the components are and the rules that we have like really easily accessible? I don't know that it, it says does. Like I'm sure the rule book, the real physical rule book would have it, but yeah. No, the setup guide is on here too. Hold on. I don't yes, think but it's it a it setup guide for screen top. Like, oh, yeah. gotcha, it doesn't. Gotcha. It doesn't say. Mm -hmm. I th we can wake up the designer. It's only like four a.m. Right? Are there times? It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Important question. You don't like sleep. <laughs> I know there's two. There's at least two of these. Um, then there's at least six of these. Yeah, I'm. There must be six of these. That there must be six of those. I'm just wondering how many more. Anyway, we got to start flipping things. And if you can't capture, we guess we got to flip. No one will okay. judge you. If, okay. If this is the end. Well, what, what's my ability here? Oh, yeah. I can take two books, so I'd be closer to being able to get something. Zoe, we're trying to figure out how many... Um, how many of the uh, terror tokens or map cards there are total? Like, what are the odds that we flip one? We know there's six revealed, seven revealed on the board already. Out of the 24, how many more terrors are there? Did Zoe play this with you earlier, Heather? Uh, no, Zoe was watching uh, for at least part of the time when we played it before, but... Uh, yeah, I'm not sure if that... Well, so there must be three more shelves and one more treasure chest out of um, I feel seven like cards. Zoe's so... expertise in tabletop should somehow come through. And... <laughs> How do I look the under the table, Zoe? <laughs> How do I um play. I <laughs> okay, step one. <laughs> I assume step one was gonna be learn Python, but this is good. I like where this is going. <laughs> yes. Um I mean, I think the odds probably are in our favor that it's not a terror because yeah, flip it. we can flip see it. nine terrors and only three shelves and one the rest of them are shelves just do it just do it. it do it okay hey okay that is a your name's on it it's a tre treasure it's yeah a treasure. i could move and take a treasure that would be the end of my turn though okay you should take a treasure but okay. it would also position you to, to turn another come. card next turn right because we haven't yeah. checked mm -hmm. this guy yet so someone's got to get there okay okay we talked you into it Looks like a free card draw and yeah. Through it. Okay, let's see what happens. Tim might not get another turn. Tim this is telling us. To... Oh, no, you're back. Card. You're back. Actually, I see you. Hi, welcome back. <laughs> I hope somebody took my turn for me if it was waiting too long. No, no, no we, we, we didn't get around to you. Oh, yeah, good. Okay. We're, even... <laughs> we're afraid to flip tiles. We're like overthinking it, I guess. We all just went on Facebook and looked at pictures of your baby. Oh, well, the, the poor thing is just had a random reason to wake up. I don't know why. <laughs> they do that um, for at least the next six years, I can tell you. Awesome. It's actually pretty rare with her. She's a good sleeper. Good for so her. So this is our, an empty tile that just rotates. For the most part. And nothing happens because it's a four-way thing. This is the Yay. one I just drew, right? Yes. Yeah. That seems right. Because legit. 12. Yeah, that's the one you flipped. 12, 13, 14, 15. Now we're moving it to 16. Okay. Yep. Okay. Everything is all right. Don't panic. <laughs> right. Amanda's going to save us. What you got, Amanda? <laughs> I'm quite Good. a bit of stuff. Uh, so ready. So ready. Um, I should draw cards for things to like murder some monsters. Right? Maybe? Because all I have is, is a card talking? that's like green, green, blue. So well, you have this green. shield has two purple. 
Oh, right. I do have two purple also because so you I could, was like, yeah, I want that. If you had some I could, red, I could you could do the kill plague. The plague. So I should get a red book, Does but it's not have... guaranteed that yeah. I would get two. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and you can get to the plague. Point. Well, you can't get to the plague right. because the trip is in the way. Unless you have... I have. You can pass through a book. I can case. pass through an active terror if from the ladder. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, yeah you yeah. could use that. I could get, do that. If, if the red had two reds, that would be really lucky. And All right, uh, so should I just do it? Let's do it. Chaotic yeah. energy all day. Let's do it. Red <laughs> card. Bam. Wait, flip that word. Okay. Nope, so, nope, nope. No. So close. So close, but so far Wait, away. Wait, does that get you something else can you kill uh, the... possibly yes actually well, maybe. piranha plants green, or the spider webs oh spider Wait. web that can solo spider webs yeah Yay, there we go i already have that song stuck in my head nice. already so i'll be the spider web player <laughs> since we flipped it over to okay so spider webs is star heart purple this is star heart purple nice. okay Okay. Steel, steel. Okay. No, now Getting you don't have places. to be so worried about that. So that was three because I did. Oh, wait. No. Yeah. Just I two. drew a card. I moved. And then I got a. Oh, that was two because I went to a thing. We'd love to put it away. We have to find. We just got to keep turning over rooms. So there's okay. one, two, but three. It's four. not so scary anymore now that you got one. That helps a lot. It's a yeah. little well, less scary. I, I, we know what this one is because that was the first tile. That was one of the tiles we flipped over, and this was a treasure chest. So, oh, we we should get, back. Okay. It, yeah. The so, thing we didn't care about that one. Really. This is like a really complicated and very long memory game. <laughs> 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 um, so, what I could do if I oh, move, I can't sense. flip anything and I can't. <clears throat> uh, yeah. Yeah. And there's nowhere for you to move to, like, <laughs> protect. You could, you, you, this seems like a good maybe moment to pass your action forward. Yeah, so pass it I and I'll try and open it. Okay. All right. Does anyone want a green, green, blue? No, I'm just passing it. Half my turn. Enjoy. Right. Because even All once right. you get there, you won't be able to pass so the card. So I with... have infinite oh, wait, hold power because I have a time machine. So I could take curse five first. actions if I want to. Oh my God. Curse first. Curse first. <laughs> Curse first. Hold, please. Yep, wrong button. Okay. Be okay. So, hey, that's good. That's, hey, I wanted hey. to flip that. Yeah. Boop. Oh, oh that's there it is. Good. That's not good at all. That's great. No, it's great because I just took one out. So right. we're going to look at this and I mean, it's going to be oh my the pure horseman of the apocalypse. Yes. <laughs> okay, cool. Good food for the Lord. Get him. Just getting slaughtered over here. <laughs> like they are, they are the harbingers of the end of the game. It's yeah. so poetically perfect. <laughs> it, it does feel like that's how it is. I feel like um, everything that's face down must be good stuff then. Oh, oh, oh. I can, oh, I can't get there. If I could get to you, oh, I can get to you. I have the trolley service. Yeah. Oh, it's a lot of things, but I can, I can actually beat the horseman. Wow. With, with your, if I, if I take your shield. Okay, Amanda. do it. Use it. Use it. There's a lot of things. So I'd have to trolley machine to get your shield. Okay. And then I'd point. have to rotate, and then I'd have to walk to them. And then I guess I could use my last action to reveal a room. We, we got to get no, rid of things. Walking, walking to them is capturing them. So Yeah, yeah. but I, I, I can't get to them. Yes, Wait a yes. So that would be my third so action would be to trolley walk. Trolley would be them. one uh, because oh. the exchange goes with the trolley. Two is walking to them and capturing them, and then three can be flipping over the other tile up there. Well, I have to rotate something to get to them. I don't I can't think go you can okay. rotate what you're standing on, so you're like oh, trapped. Oh. You can actually. You, you can? can rotate. You can, yeah, it's in the rules. Oh, yeah, good. good. Yay. Okay. That's Never how mind. secret passages work. Okay, so I think that's plan A. Is Can I just get yes, the Jabberwockies? Is that a better thing? Two blue. I don't have the green. You have the green. Do you have pink? I have no pink. I've had no pink all game. Uh, it completely yeah. tracks for me as a character. Does anyone so. have green <laughs> and pink? Sorry, yeah, just a little green. No Nine. Man, we, we are shy on the green this game. I mean, you can right. have, if you want my library card, you can take two. Well, you don't have room in your, wait, no. You do have room in your hand. You could have two pink books at once. 
or you could draw two cards if you have my library card or okay. you can mimic a book character in your own if you had my i have a so library card and a photocopier so one or the other of those things. okay Perfect. playing all the actions and then there's also the trifa trifadasia things trips trifids and no one has a real clean way to finish those off right no there's so not a one punch to get that out of there <laughs> everything requires pink and pink is what we have not mm -hmm. all right then I think I'm just going to try and take on the four horsemen because that was the clearest path to not losing this turn. Do it. Uh, and then Heather can keep exploring down there. Maybe we'll find our way through. All right. So I am going to trolley service to take your, uh, I need, shield. I need you to right. lend me your shield and someone else's ax and someone else's. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, and I don't yeah. think I need anything else from you. I guess you can hang on to the green in case that's useful. I mean, secret if you passage. Want to... Ooh, ooh, ooh! If you give me your secret passage, I could. If unless you think you're going to use it, I can no, walk go ahead, take through it. the shelf. No, go for it. I'm I am the most co-op-y game player ever. I'm like, no, take it. You're getting so <laughs> better than I will. <laughs> much sooner if you do it. For, yes. it'll be All useful right. exactly yeah and then i'm going to use secret passage for my second action to just walk right through the wall because there was actually a book i pulled on yes and i'm going to defeat nice. the horses with is it camilla or camilla i want to i would say camilla but i don't really know no no one here is fluent in roman okay it's camilla latin. with it's the latin spear latin. of minerva and the shield of Oh, is yeah. Latin the same as Spanish? Is the double L? You're, uh, you're, you're combining the, the, sh the shield of Boudicca with a Roman hero. That's funny. Yeah, that but should be I know, right? Though. It's kind of really fucky. <laughs> that should be. <laughs> it's right. not ideal. <laughs> we don't know what this is yet, right? Uh, right. I think that's only two moves. That's two. That's two and moves. And I have four. four actions. I'm sorry, my turn's going so slow. Okay, three. I'm oh, going to. We don't right. know this, right? I'm going to flip this. I don't do it. So. Do it. Oh my oh, god! You're me. <laughs> it's all bad, all the way down. It's horrible. Okay, well, don't touch that one Mr. anymore, Hyde. guys. What is it? What is it? Hey, oh, green yes. and purple. Can someone Dr. be Doctor Jekyll and Mister oh, Hyde? That's fun. Uh, oh, if you still have that shield, you could do I, it. But... I still right. have the two green. Your shield. I all right, and the then for my last from action. Hypatia. Are you kidding um, me? Well, we know when it flips, it's not going to be able to. Maybe it'll flip this one. That would be amazing. That would yeah, help us. I'm, I'm going to pass I mean, the reaction to uh, to Tim. Tim, you've got four actions, and I'm going to do the curse. And okay. oh, it, it rotates. Yeah. That's fun. Yeah, because it's That's actually helpful. It's fine. Yeah. All right. It's good. And it Come moves, on, and it's Tim's turn. All right. So, like, we actually need to find our last shelves, right? We know where they are. It's here, or here, or here. It's yeah. one of those three, and there's Has two. Of these three. Uh, it's got to mm -hmm. be pretty it unlucky. Might, the curse might flip one of these over, so that we could flip them again and get a new spawned token too. So, so you know, like, right. that's good. On this turn, we have a pretty good chance of that happening on when the curse goes. Should on Tim turn. try and end his turn here, possibly, to block mm -hmm. the summoning mm -hmm. of a? I think that's uh, my that's my plan. Yeah, you but also, move, flip, it makes me nervous. Move. I could move, flip, move, flip. And then I'd be able actions. to flip this one. Yeah, it was yeah. my turn. That I can do all four, really actually. I can do them all because I have an extra move. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like that's, that true. that's true. That's true. The thing is, though, if I flip over one one more monster, we're done. There that's can't true. be more monsters. Right? <laughs> we found Same as last words, but yeah. I, I called, the, I called I mean, the designers and they said we found them all. There's no more. It's but okay. I can't, the thing is, I it's can't fight them right now i could try to like delve for books to fight some but that just feels like a little bit yeah i think i think there has to be at least two right more now. bookshelves honestly okay i'm just gonna do Plato it our outs that are so, out is there you go. Yes. yes the other two are bookshelves no matter what no not that oh. one <laughs> <laughs> okay we got a heart that's good okay um do you have a heart to deliver you can deliver your thorns to it i can but i can't reach it in. Actually, okay. So that's, that was one, two. You could rotate this tile ah, and then right. move to it. Three. Yay. Nice. 
We're getting there. Okay. So the thorns go to the heart. Oh no! Oh, but that's not good. We don't have any. Do we have it? Have we ended up collecting some green after all now? Or I have, have some green. I have two greens, no matter what. And we have a bad. If beginning. we could get the triffids, then we'd have a green. Yeah, there's yeah. like a green monster. Well, I also have a green monster with the wolf. And then the oh, plague is green, wolf. purple, red. Okay, good. Oh, never mind. So we're just gonna get it back we, around. Yeah, if we hit yeah. a green, green pave away. For Tim. If we hit, yeah, if, if we hit a green shelf, I can put the wolf back in, and then we're done. Oh wait! As long as we oh, get shoot. back to your turn. We no. made a we made a mistake. What's that? You're oh. not blocking the, the oh the no. Spook. Yep. Well. Well, I I mean we haven't flipped it yet, so I don't think it would be cheating to realize that and take the turn back because your turn's not really over. But it feels a little bit like cheating. Just flip it. Just do it. If you don't realize, uh, I have a lot of chaotic we energy We don't know going on what here. would happen if we flip the card, so it's not it's, it's it. not cheating that's, in that way, in my opinion. But yeah. If we lose, we lose. I'm just crossing yeah, my fingers. True. All right. I'm okay with losing a game. It's not the end of the world. That's true. <laughs> See? Awesome. Oh, that's good. Awesome. That's really good. <laughs> That's really great. Ta -da. That gives us another book spot, guaranteed. Don't overthink yes. it. Yes. That's awesome. Okay. okay. Comically dusts hands as if that was part of the plan. <laughs> no, David. Exactly, David. That's Mom what I like to for watching it. us Make be the decision. morally high ground. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's recorded forever in perpetuity it'll be on the internet archive forever ever that's right. <laughs> right this was scruples on display so this is um wait is it my turn now yeah I'm, yes. it's back to you sorry mm -hmm. okay and i don't have a, gr a green thing that's been no but we know we know this is a uh uh a library and place. i only have uh well it yeah i only have a uh, three turn three moves and I think it's going to be physically impossible. I have a green, a blue. Can I make a suggestion? Green. green. Yes, do it. Green and blue. Yeah, I mean, I could potentially get the Jabberwocky, but not really, because I can't get there. Wait, what's going on? Manda's hand is in the way. What's going on right here? There we go. Sorry. It's okay. Yeah, I, I'm gonna have to. I'd have to do some rotating and such that would take a lot of effort. What What is your suggestion? Um, move up one for action number one. Action two, flip this to reveal the last uh, token, and then three, end your turn blocking the yeah, yeah. the spook. Perfect. And somebody who's in a better spot. We'll just try and pave the way for Tim yeah. to to uh, to funnel in the last one. Okay. Well, hopefully this is not a monster. Okay. It can't be, right? There's no No, way. it literally can't be. Oh, wait, no, there. Uh, I didn't count right. Okay, this one just rotates. Maybe. It's good. Clockwise. Yeah, we're okay. Yeah. Wait, okay. does that rotate or does it go down? No, that goes. Well, it's occupied that with goes the down to the empty. Oh, right. It to dark. You're right. Wait, what? Shift R. Yep. <laughs> no, 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 if because it, it says. If it had. This would have something like this would have rotated, oh, or if I was oh, standing I there, it would have rotated. Mm -hmm. But it was other empty. Tile. Flip it back. Okay. All right. It was like a good tile that was empty. It was a non-monster yeah. tile that was empty. So gotcha, gotcha. Gotcha. Okay, we are. Oh, move the oh, move yeah. the orange tile. All right, we're in a pretty good spot. Amanda, let's yeah. let's get Tim home. Okay. Let's do it. Let's get our boys home. Ready. Get him, get him to the green tree. <laughs> he's, he's carrying the, the payload. I'm, I'm carrying a wolf. A big get bad home. wolf. This is the main reason why I can never pull off a bank heist, because I literally cannot remember what the plan was. <laughs> uh, operation bring wolf to tree. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Tim is good at blue. Blue needs to end up here at yeah. this spot. So... Blue needs to flip this. Yeah. Okay. So if I move here, one, I rotate this, two, and then I give my action to the next player as okay. three. Okay. Then next, oh, then Michael yeah. can get figure out the rest of it. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh... Fastest turn ever. <laughs> Oh, wait, we have to do the curse thing. Sorry, sorry, sorry. 
Yes. And we're going to hope for not top left. Hey, occupied. Oh, oh no, Tim gets spun. Oh, F. That Heck. Is a <laughs> oh, shoot. Okay. That's okay. I can still do it. You passed can, an can... action, though, too, as well, right? Yeah. I did pass an action. So Tim, next I'm going to try and pass... scuffle that action to you. Also, we need to move Sweet. the curse to here. Oh, yep. See, I told okay. you I was going to forget. I remembered so exactly So whatever I do, be I'll, really I'm, good for you to end there. Yeah. Yes, that would be supremely beneficial for us. Make it. I think you can make it all the way there and just one. You can. So what do I want to do with my other two actions? Anything? Um, Probably not. I don't like, think so. Um, extra flip and... I'm looking for anything else I can do to help Tim. Uh, library card photocopier when you move mimic none of that helps him i think it's just going to give as many actions as possible and try and get him to to make it to the green mm -hmm. this is jabberwockies in the way if i rotate my place hang on is it always is it rotating in either direction or is it rotating when oh, you it, go you can go either direction yeah so i could go rotate one rotate two yeah that's what mm -hmm. i want to do I'm going to rotate rotate space easily. I'm going to rotate one. Action two is rotate two. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to go rotate. This is my third action. And I'll pass my fourth action to Tim. Nice. Cool. Okay, so my action. Oh, it Wait, hit the spot too. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, my God. So I get rotated. Ooh, lost. That good. was an amazing move. Okay, so I rotate once to it here. It finally paid off. We got there. It's, oh no! Um, it's oh, way. that's you're taking your move. Okay, you're yeah. rotating. So then one, the one action. Action two is to go here and drop them off, and then that is yes. game. Hey, we did it! We made it. Getting y'all in here so I can record that we won. That was intense. In my, in my down uh, to the wire for sure. I love I this game. I feel like we have to cheer Great. quietly, both because it's eleven o'clock and because we're in a massive library. But I want to. Yeah. Uh, sorry about your luck. It's only nine. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Mountain time rules. Anyway. <laughs> okay. So now that we're all done, we want to do that little game with whoever is still watching us. I, we should have done it in the middle when everybody was with us, but it's like awkward to break up. Now we have all the dialogue. No, you have an so. intermission. It's like it's like the little yeah, yeah. popcorn. Yeah. Get mm -hmm. the thing. Get the popcorn and hot dogs. We did it, Mr. Marco Polos. Anybody who's here right now is a ride that's, or die. That's Ms. Ashley. <laughs> that's a big boy, Ashley, by the way, Michael. That's who's Mr. The one that Parker. starts with Mr. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's true. It's, I get it. It's M.R. Parker Pulls. Right. Mr. Like, Parker, please. Huge yeah. fan of Spider Man. Spider -Man. Is basically what that means. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Woohoo! Okay. Twitch man. All right. If, I if feel anything like... will teach you not to assume pronouns, it's Twitch usernames. That's true. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay. So, whoever's with us, we're going to give away Spider Man. <laughs> we're going to give away the... Spider Person. Thank you. One, one. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> it's Spider Man. <laughs> um, uh, one copy of the secret snail mail prize for people who won Shout Out of Palooza, which Michael is an example of this person. Michael was here in January 2022, and his team was P Team Spades, Go and they Spades. gave the most shout outs. And so he's getting one of these anyway. We were just the best team, so. <laughs> and uh, and a t-shirt. Oh. I'm not wearing one of them today, but there's a couple of those of guys. There. So we're going to play two to... really, really, before we say goodbye, we're going to play two really, really quick games of The Price is Right. And we're going to kind of, we've themed them. We, we did this together before we got on live. First, we'll talk real quick about uh, Tim's game, which is Mononoke. And for Mononoke, we have, oh, no, 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 no. I, I did the wrong thing. <gasps> oh, please. I have to plug in my laptop. It's about to die. Oh, no. Sorry. We had two kids crying. I know. It's very bad. It's contagious. Okay. 
I just showed you the price. Did you guys see what I put up? Oh, I don't think Tell me the truth. It. Did you see it? I didn't I see know. it. In the chat? I was looking. I was Only distracted. the chat's playing. So, although. Oh, I would actually, play. You're fine. You can play. Actually, it'd be awesome I if you play. I expect you to that. mail me the prize, too. <laughs> I wouldn't even go have to down the 29th Street post office that's farther away from my house than you are. Okay. I'll believe you. I'll believe you. I needed to do it this way. I need to go to a different place show it to you here okay there you go where the the price has been blocked out so this is something on ebay what is the buy it now price of this i'm gonna say one two three go and when i say go press like enter type in what the price you think it is is when i say Wait. go press enter i can't play and oh because you're not on twitch no, can you because open? the thing is over there and it doesn't give me a, I can only do the private chat. It's fine. Go ahead. Well, type it in the private chat for me and I'll type it in the public chat Oh, we're for playing you. too? Nice. You can play too Might if as you well. want. Yeah. yeah. Okay. 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 In private chat, I'll go one, two, three. So you don't see each other's and I'll put it in publicly so everybody can see for you. So ready? Yep. Press it. Okay, and so now for, although, well, I, I don't know if, I feel like Tim saw it when I was setting it up, but I don't know if you remember it. I don't remember it at all, sorry. I, <laughs> I can Scarcely. imagine you don't remember it. Um, a lot went on in this Do you want to send, send me yours too, Tim? I, I'm, in, I'm in the chat. Oh, you're in the real chat. Mm -hmm. Really? Mm -hmm. I don't see you coming through. That's weird. Huh. I'm just, I'm just Cardboard Revolution in the real chat. Yeah, but I didn't see any message come in for you in my dashboard oh. here. Oh, I haven't sent it yet. Oh, of course, because I didn't, <laughs> I didn't, didn't say go. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Okay, I was confused. You were confused with the counting. Yes, we're all confused. And I, I, know, I was it confused with this. Okay. Okay, I'm doing it for Amanda. Everybody type in your price, and I'll say one, two, three, go. Okay. Nobody else is going to play, just you? Oh, no. Okay. okay. Oh, no. <laughs> this is the... Oh, it's like, like, no, we got, we got that. I don't want Japanese candy. I heard you have too much well, of that Well, you're not in winning house. Japanese candy. You're winning oh. this. Oh, but I wanted Japanese candy. I quit. <laughs> I don't have any Japanese candy. Do you want to play, Mr. Parker, please? Ms. Ashley or Zoe, are you there? You don't have to buy it. No, they're like, no, nah, I'm out of here. They heard it wasn't... <laughs> Do it. <laughs> oh, come on. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to reveal it then. Over here. Oh, wait. Right. Hold on. Spider oh, Spider person on. says, yes, we play. Hold okay, on. Okay. Okay. Hold on. <laughs> They're just thinking. No, there's no thinking. Just enter a number. Just pick a number. <laughs> Make it eight. Say eight dollars. Oh no! no. Right here. In, in the Twitch chat, where you're. Yeah, there, there you go. go. Perfect. <laughs> there it is. That's Sorry. a lot of candy. Oh, technology. Okay. All right, you're ready. Now I'm gonna show you. Never mind. What it costs. Cool. $23.59. Oh my god. That's that's such a that's good so price cheap. is right value. Price because it's like such a random number. Mm-hmm. Well, very very well done to Amanda for that guess then, because we all got we were all way off. All right, so now what? Thirty-two. I think you. No, but it. I went over, so I don't. It doesn't oh, count. Oh, thirty-two. Without going yeah, over. Yeah, you guys Twenty-three. You all, we all went over. We all, all did. lost. I won again. We're a bunch of losers! <laughs> Yay! I won by a mission. Yeah, that is how it works. Stupid Ooh. prices, right? Game. It doesn't work always. If if yeah, you don't have enough guessers. That is <laughs> you don't hilarious. Know what to do. So. Oh, well, that's hilarious. <laughs> Just give it to the closest I feel, person. I feel like the closest person is the right yeah. winner, right? You got to do it. house rule that. Yeah, that's the house rule. <laughs> house you rule it. price is right. Okay, exactly. cool. Perfect, Amanda. Like and I, I can just uh, 
the next time I see you. I'm going to get in my car right you. now and drive to your house. I'll be right back. We, we can literally <laughs> walk to each other's house. It would take like 20 minutes, but we could do it. Oh, no, um, I'm not walking. I'm so lazy. Are you kidding? No. <laughs> God. Okay. The next one is, so that's, that's, that Japanese candy is in honor of Tim's game, Mononoke, which is a um, semi-cooperative game about Japanese yokai and you're defending a cursed castle and, and all kinds of monsters are coming your way. Now, Michael, one of Michael's games is, and I'll, I mean, Tim has others too, but one of Michael's games is The Clearing that is a deck builder about uh, food chains and animals and nature. The so we doors. decided we're going to do the bear spray. What the is the puts buy it now at price? The top of the food chain. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Cat dog defense, 9.2 ounce pepper spray with a holster, USA made. Holster, <laughs> it makes the whole deal way better. Oh my God. <laughs> so, I've got the price back behind here. So, Amanda, you go ahead and since you can't get to Twitch, you tell me before I could. everybody else. I could. I just, I mm, apparently can't technology right now. Okay. But everybody else, number. enter yeah. enter in your number. Okay. Remember the lowest. And this is for a t-shirt. without going over. Whatever color right. you right. want. Unless we house rule, because up. apparently the points don't might count. might have to do that. No, 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 no. You, you got to wait, Mr. Park, please. <laughs> oh, no <laughs> shit. This is what I was going to send right now. <laughs> That's a really good guess, though. I'm okay. pretending I don't see it. I pretend I do not see it. <laughs> oh, do, have I made it so you can see it? No way. I no, guess the private over chat the is side. between all the moderators or oh, the I see, live I see. people. No, we're just teasing. We're fine. We're having a all good right. time. Is it's everybody somewhere ready? Between nine and yeah. eleven p.m. One, <laughs> two. Well, here, let me write and label this as Amanda. Okay. One. Two, three. Right, here they come. Okay. It's gonna be like seventeen dollars and sixteen cents or some dumb shit. <laughs> then. Yeah, that's true. That's true. <laughs> you can do you whatever. The the if we're gonna go one office. after the other, I want a boat and a vacation to like oh, yeah. Cancun. Okay. <laughs> want to win a car? Okay. Yeah. I think everybody's got them in. And uh, I'll take this away. Got to reveal. What? Forty-five dollars, almost. You can't, so, you can't put a price on not being mauled by a bear. I that's can. true. I can. It's called staying inside. Okay. <laughs> I, my wife and I are planning a trip to Glacier National Park, and oh, I've never best. carried bear spray before, but we're going to carry some because grizzly bears are <laughs> yes <laughs> yes exactly wait, wait, go, watch the revenant. go watch the revenant your goal is Hard to money. not Gosh. glacier owns you're gonna have a lot of fun uh, i'm cool, so excited cool park. i'm so excited but we're we doing saw, some we overnight saw, backpack camping we and saw grizzly bears within about 10 minutes of arriving they're just everywhere yes. it's shocking yes we don't intend to use anything but they told us you'd be stupid to not carry it especially because we're doing some camping yeah, just in case. Mm -hmm. Okay, Tim, you won. You didn't celebrate at all. But... Oh my god, I won! I didn't even realize. <laughs> yeah, that's why you, you didn't celebrate. You have to wear your t-shirt the next this time you're on the... stream. I'm gonna wear the t-shirt next time. Wait a, minute, wait a minute. Where did you go? Thirty-one what? is the closest without going over. Yeah. Got him. It was still a still an awful guest, but you know what? <laughs> we love to see it. So yeah, we'll be in touch about uh, getting your choices for. Um, for the t-shirts i'll show you really quick kind of where you get them on our website oh, also awesome. i will take a moment to announce that i'll give, show you this link this is details about our accountability buddy match that's included in your badge for april 29th through may 1st our, our next convention if you buy before this coming monday night you'll get included in this whole buddy match thing um here's kind of a preview of the questions oh, that you can you'll get asked when you take the survey and you'll get matched with other people who answered the most similarly to you on these topics of interest. You could get matched with one of us. Yeah. I don't know if that's I an probably, incentive or a cautionary tale, but I probably will. It's a cautionary on, tale for this one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> for sure. And, and we also, I'll show you really quick. The merch is right here. 
And this yeah, is what we're talking about. Bear spray. <laughs> and get one of these t-shirts or one of these t-shirts in a wide variety of colors. That's what you'll be choosing from. Fantastic. Him. So, okay. Um, and yeah, t-shirt. just uh, back to saying, yeah, thanks to the designers for Library Labyrinth teaching me this earlier this week. Uh, congratulations to them meeting all their stretch goals on Kickstarter. Yay! Ooh, and congratulations yeah. Yay. to us for just barely winning um, in the screen top GG mod. Hooray! I wish I had like a little confetti uh, email. Gotta get Where's on Zach? Where's Zach when you need him? <laughs> right. We need we need custom emojis and, and uh, emails people can spam in the chat yeah, for us. Yeah, we need right? fireworks. Um, we when, you need to be affiliate to have all that stuff, and I believe that this stream will make us affiliate yes. in the morning once it's Bam. Uh, counted as a day that we we streamed within thirty days because uh, nice. this is the seventh one. So yes, thank you guys for joining me, making that happen. Yeah, it's gonna be beautiful, baby. Baby. Yay. 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 Name of wheels as a confetti overlay, <laughs> <laughs> animated. <laughs> No, it's just big chunks of confetti that just stay there. <laughs> you have to like wipe Permanent it off party. the screen. All right. Awesome, you all. Thank you for joining us. And we'll see you next week, same time, same. <laughs> Maybe it'll be animated. Not sure. Not sure about animated. And I can understand because uh, it mutes you when things move over the screen usually. So oh, Maybe it's still confetti like if I, I, you know what I'll do? I'll turn it on and off really fast, David. <laughs> Just like confetti. It'll, totally seem like, it'll seem like it's animated. All mm -hmm. right. It'll feel real. All right, you all. Yeah. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next week. Next week, we'll be playing Bittersweet with the designer, Matthew Hawker. Wow. Uh, Love um, Bittersweet. <laughs> and David will be joining game. us and playing at the table next week, too, not just in the chat. And uh, it'll be at 9 p.m. again, Eastern. So we'll see you then. Thanks, Very everybody. Cool. Later, guys. Good night, y'all. Good night.